you know, Baruch Hashem, I could learn. You have to be a people person in order to learn. You just can't, uh, uh, you can't uh, just learn by yourself without communicating with other people. That was my disability. That was, that was the beginning of, that was my disability. And I had a lot of setbacks, but, but now it's, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's part of my life. It's, uh, it's like food. You ha I have to do it in order to live. You know, you know, I, I can't live without it. But uh, the learning is, uh, you know, is a uh, is a big part of my life. Unless you do kiddush yadayim raglayim from the kiyor. Now, where was the kiyor? Between the Mizbeach and... Between the Mizbeach and Koshka. So it was all the way there, on the other end of the Azara, just in front of... Uh, in... You would think that when you, when you start Daf Yermi, you, you're doing it to be Kivei Yit and Lotaira, but the Daf Yermi is actually Kivei your life, because the Daf Yermi builds on you and the Torah, the, 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 your children and your family see that you have a commitment to Torah, and that builds on your life, and every day gets more and more and more that commitment, and therefore you as a person change. And obviously for our children, we're trying to have... You know, we want them to be raised to, uh, you know, to love Torah and to love mitzvahs and to have a relationship with Hashem. So role modeling and you know, living that way ourselves is the greatest way to, to raise our children. I see a very big impact on my family in the last past 20 years that they see their father going out every night to learn. It, it, it gives me a lot of pleasure to see that my kids are, are, are really shepping nachas from their father to see that they, that their father sits down and learns every day. It's something that I'm giving over to them that they can see, yes, this is something that a person who's out there in the working world can still sit down and, and, and have time for learning. <laughs> שם הריון, כמו ילדנו רוח, זאת אומרת גם אפילו שהלידה בסופו של דבר הייתה לידה של רוח, זה נקרא, זה נקרא מעוברת, זה נקרא הריון. I think a tremendous uh, debt of gratitude goes out to the women, to the particular the wives of the men who are involved in this, because very often men take away time that rightfully would belong to their wives and the families, and to be on schedule for their classes at night or in the morning. And women gladly send their husbands out to do this, so any mitzvahs that accrue to the husbands and to the men for learning Torah, part of that mitzvah certainly goes to the women, and they have to feel a sense of pride and joy in being part of this worldwide experience. For 20 years I've been going out every night and saying this year and missing my the crunch time at home, the bedtimes and the homeworks, and my wife has manned that responsibility, and in her schus and in the schus of thousands of other women like her, that is the, their schus helps keep the Daf Yomi dream and Limud Atar alive. A person is Moyel and Kodesh Hashem. Kodesh Hashem comes in one of two main groups and then subgroups. The main groups of Kodesh Hashem are Kodesh Berek which is things that have...
و خالیاییم من تقوی شفت قیل محبوب شده ایمال حقیقی قیل مطای حقیقی حقیقی قیل حلوم You have gone through that which is the light source, that which is the totality of our understanding and reach and desires and hope. You have to stay to the always. Ik kan me dat man zustaan tot de arbeid. Eén ben ik hot en pas voor mij zijn arbeid. Is de mij zijn arbeid. Van de dag aan mijn zielers nerfes. Van tijden. I was in this by the past team of Shas. I saw so many clients all getting together being Messiah Shas. I wanted to be part of it. Since then, I've been learning Daf Yomi every day. And I've found that uh, over the past seven and a half years, the amount of Torah that, uh, Gemara that I've been able to learn uh, and retain has been significantly more than the previous seven and a half years. After the last Siyam Shas, I had a uh, Cyrus to start learning Daf Yomi. I don't think I had intention to do it prior to going to the Siyam. But um, once I came back, it was immediate. I mean, I just started right away. Uh, I was at the Siyam seven years ago, and uh, it was certainly exciting. But now having it all together in one place, I think, is even more exciting. And when you start thinking about the satellites and all the different places that are, that are being Messiahed together, uh, it's exciting to belong to such a thing. I will say, Adonadecha, Talmud Bafli. Whoever heard such beautiful words, such sweet words, Adonadecha, Talmud Bafli. Why do you do this? Why do you do this? Why do you do this? Why do you do this?
um Wittmann ou dem Sium, dos os ainda se com, para o dique deixe. Eu vou dizer, as glórias que nós temos, as atcufe, o senhor no rio, bem tês para uns, para mim persönlich, a schreckliche Überlebnis, das ist der Heilige, wenn man umgebracht hält, und alle ihre Gedächte umgebracht, ich schiebe, ich stört, die Rosse ich schiebe, mein Geist in der Welt, der Pelzer auf, schäm in Köln der Möhe, der Krechts ist nicht auf Pelz, der Krechts ist auf Preschburg, auf Warsche, auf Lemberg, auf Krakow, auf Frankfurt, auf wo ist ein Lieden gewesen und auf dem wieder Krechts. A little more than 15 years ago in Brooklyn, Shlomi Mostovsky was Zoycha to finish Shas. He had learned Dafyemi for seven and a half years and his wife made him a beautiful party, a siyam, and many, many friends and family attended. One of the people that attended was Shlemy's younger brother, Shalom, from Norfolk, Virginia. He was so inspired by the whole idea of his brother learning Shas, and he was inspired by what his brother had to say, what it meant to learn Shas. I was so inspired by, by hearing him talk and hearing other people talk about this, that when I came back to Norfolk, I spoke to the, to the Rav here in Norfolk, uh, Rabbi Friedman, and decided that, uh, you know, I, was, I told him I was going to start Dafyomi, and he said he was going to join me, and through that we had other people joining, and from that we were about to finish our second cycle of Dafyomi here in Norfolk, Virginia. One of the people in that group was an 80-year-old man, Mr. Bernie Schloss, Hashem Shadlou. Bless him. Imagine an 80 year old fellow has finished Shas twice. When I first started doing Daf, uh, I was coming early in the morning and doing a little learning by myself. And Charles Mostovsky asked me to join the group. And I did. I think people see us sitting here every single morning before they come to Shul. When they come in, they see us sitting there. I think it just inspires everybody else. You know, whatever they're learning, it could be you know, an English safer, it could be you know, with Chavusa, whatever it is, people are coming to the Shul and learning. When you have a group of people every single day coming and making a commitment of learning, I think it just inspires other people and it's just bringing everyone else out to learn also. Hakoreyas and Megillah Lemafreya, if somebody reads the Megillah backwards. So he starts off with Haman getting hung and then, all the way, then he goes all the way back to um, Esther becoming queen. Lo Yotze has not fulfilled his obligation. Kro al Pef, he read the Megillah by heart. Kro al Targum, or if you read the translation of the Megillah. The first day of Elo is going to be Rosh Hashanah for Maisa Behema. When you tithe your animals, you're going to need to make sure that this year's animals don't get mixed up with last year's animals. When is Rosh Chodesh? When is Rosh Hashanah for that? First day of Elo, Rebbe Lazar, Rebbe Shimon Omrim, Be'echa B'Tishrei. And Rebbe Lazar, Rebbe Shimon. What I gained from this year is that now when I look up other Gemaras, or I'm learning other things throughout the day. As this is not my main focus of the day, I'm in Kailu and I learn two other, two other starim. But when a Taisvis or other Rishayinim, or a Shail Satshuva Sefer will bring down the Gemaras, especially now we're learning Kachim, which are far flung, and especially Krisus, Bechayrus, the Temura, these Gemaras. So now I know what the Gemara is talking about, I know what the Rishayinim are talking about, I have a greater understanding of what is uh, what the Achreinim and the Paiskim are trying to bring as proofs or as questions to their idea and content. They eventually went out, they had a din, mi'ilo durabonon, but ultimately, since the Beis Hamikdash got some revenue out of it, they were able to go and sell it and water the grass. Today they would go and sell it in Eichler's with a big sign of it, the dam from Kabarnas is a big... Uh, it's, a tummy, it's a small amount, and it becomes mixed into a larger amount, and it becomes bottle. The question is, if it's mixed together with more of that same type, can it become, can it be revitalized and make things stomach? We talked about this at two different levels. One is, if it's mixed with something of the same type,
I was in very bad shape after, at liberation itself. I never thought that I would be able to, to survive it. Three months after liberation that I started to be able to function as a human being. After the war, my father uh, discovered Dafyomi in the early 1960s. It started with a one Harusa and quickly uh, turned into a shear that was very popular in Washington, D.C. After about a year, I found that we had close to 10 people sitting around the table. And there were, most of those people never saw Gomorrah or never had anything to do with Gomorrah. And his whole day was really framed by Dafyomi. Preparation, Chazara, actually giving the shear, speaking to the people who entered the shear, and it literally changed his life. And now my father has finished Shah seven times. All of these different things are considered to be a Surya know that have to be buried, and they are not men on this rough, and therefore, even though they rot, they fall apart, they still retain. Something that I feel is the center of my life, that I have my whole day focused around this, that I have to be here at a certain time. I know I have to get out of my office at a certain time, drop what I'm doing. My whole day is different as a result. I look forward to the daf every day. It's my vitamin for the soul. It gives me chiefs and it gives me a lot of encouragement to uh, get through the day. Uh, and my grandchildren are always uh, check on me and say, are you attending the daf yomi? When I started learning Gamora in daf yomi with the explanation and the notes and all of the discussion that go along with it, all it does is encourage me more and more to keep on. It doesn't matter which level you're on. Um, you know, once you begin, uh, you're going to only want to learn more, and it's something that makes you feel good. The Fiyomi is contagious. Once you start, you just can't stop. You know, I started uh, with the, about 14 years ago, and uh, I considered at the, at the last, um, when we finished the last time, I thought I would stop. Then I went to see him, and it was just so inspirational. I just kept going, and here we are seven and a half years later. Gemara study in general, and especially Dafyomi, has impacted my working life. When I go to work, I find myself thinking in Gemara terms and the what ifs and, uh, and trying to think of the Hava Amina, really, really thinking in that way. And when you finish a Masechta, you know, it's a high. And then you finish another Masechta and another Masechta. Ain't Tumul Mafreya at all. No, 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 no. How are we going to treat the tyrus that 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 tummy? I did the thesis with you. We're going to treat the the tyrus, the suffolk, right? It's not vaday tummy. It's suffolk tummy. Yeah. Hier da hoif nafshi sakli mi misoyra secha soyra secha ubiya 
guys that get together to go over the last week's Shakla Vitarvya of Dafyomi and where each person is responsible for one day. And by each person doing this, we're able to go through the whole Dafyomi of the week in about an hour. So, Amarav, Rav, Rashila, Amar Rav, Mas Namar Shmuel, Maisa. He's going to bring that additional yeah, case. It's, it's not 95 days, it's been just 94 so, days. So, Rav says, we see from here that when it says it's Korach, it's not really Korach that they're Mach... Rav Huda Machshir, Rav Huda disagrees, Rav Huda holds that the Sukkah is Kshera, and then we'll explain if the sukkah is not even 10 tzvachim high, or if the sukkah does not have three walls, people who are learning a daf yomi in the early in the mornings, late in the evenings, at the uh, off ends of the day, um, those are the people who are the backbones of the community. No different on, on some of them, those who are attending all the daily minyanim. And they are the people who make the community go uh, each and every day. Among all the other learning that's going on, uh, these are the key founding elements into a shul, is the Torah learning that's going on there. And these people who make up these regular shiurim are at the heart of that, whether people know it or not or realize it that that's the case, but they're really what makes the, the shul go uh, on, on a day in and day out basis. Even though people have busy days and long days and they're exhausted, but they know they've got to be there because if you miss one day, it just piles up one after the other. And people are there because that commitment, they've made that commitment and it creates that type of kvies item that is necessary for somebody who doesn't have the structure of a first seder, second seder, night seder. Much as Pesach when it's very hard to come to such a shear and you see 30 people come at the whole shear was here on time, 40 minutes after Shkia, I'm sure with their wife's permission, and we delved into the shear as if it was a regular night. My Rebbe Muvchak. Uh, Rav Noach Weinberg Zatzal uh, was very strong in conveying that we have a chiyuv to learn kolat Torah kula. The idea of not only seeing all of Shas but learning all of Shas and having access to all of Shas. When I was in yeshiva, no matter how much I was learning, but there were mesechtas that you never got to, and there were things that I heard about, and I just dreamed of being more familiar with them, and all of a sudden I have a shaykhis to Tyra, to call it Tyra Kula in a certain manner of speaking. So we assume that it belongs to the Bala Shevach. But if it come, if you find it uh, outside of 50 Yama, we say it doesn't come from that uh, nest, but rather it belongs to the Moitza, it belongs to the one who finds it. If you find it between two Shevchais, two dove codes. Test records. If you know it's a firstborn, you treat it like a firstborn. If you don't know, so then you treat it like a suffolk and you let it graze till it gets blemished and then you eat it. And if you know for sure that it has other children, there's nothing to talk about.
There I was, sick in bed, racked with pain from cancer, but giving me hope and strength during the difficult time was the daf. My chavrusa was, would come to the hospital and we would learn together and it would lift me up and it would give me hope every day. I remember it was the time of Psachim and I always have an affinity for Masechus Psachim because that was the Masechta during the most difficult time of treatment. It was a tremendous chizuk to think that here we were in, the, in this kind of setting, sitting and learning the Da'at. Beginning of Masechta Abba the Zohar, the Gemara tells us the Rabboni Shalom Hashem is Baruch learns Torah with little children. And Rashi explains Tinokas Shemesu Bekatnusam. These are the children that Lo'aleinu Lo'alechem died when they were still young. Now let us think for one horrifying minute of the one million Jewish children. I say one million Jewish children amongst the six million who were made to be cut and That means they were massacred and sacrificed when they were still young. I once read that somebody who miraculously escaped from inside a gas chamber heard the cry of a young boy imploring his mother, Mama, bin ich nicht allemal gewesen a guter Jingle? Mother, wasn't I always a good boy? At that very moment, when this holy neshama expired, the Rabboni Shalom took it up, Kavi Yochel, into his arms, saying to him, Och, mein Kind, yes, you were always a good child. From now on, I shall take you into my arms, and I shall become your Rebbe. I shall learn with you. You shall learn in my Mesifta Shalmaila together with your brothers and sisters and fathers and mothers Hashem Yikam Domam. And so we dedicate this Siyam to them, to all the Gedoshim, with the Horem Shemosa Nafshem Al Kiddush Hashem. Or he shechted kachim, which is obviously can't be done outside, but he did it outside instead of being inside the azara. Or chaya of haniskalim, or if it was a wild animal, uh, a chaya, an undomesticated animal, or a bird, haniskalim that should be right, sub- surrounding like a ches. You see the heichel the kodesh kedoshim. You have the little rooms which are marked number 67, 67, 67. If you see that, just going all around, going from Mizrach to Ma'ariv, right? They're going across. The Marav side on top. That's a major thing. The the unity. The, the unity. All the all the, the Jews of the world, whatever they are, America, Australia, uh, South America, they are participating in the same, the same. Uh, uh, the, the, the purpose of uh, Meir Shapiro. Learning the Dafir, not just learning any seder, being part of so many people learning the same thing every day, and meeting people who are learning the Dafir and me who I don't even know to be able to discuss the Daf and answer a question or ask a question. It's a connection. Uh, you're part of something greater uh, than who you are. You're connecting to the teachers of the past and with the right Rebbe that brings Dafyomi alive, it all of a sudden becomes relevant to the present. Um, so it's a connection to the past and it's relevant to the present. It's like an unbroken chain. And uh, just, it's just so satisfying to, uh, to be able to be part of that, to be able to think that I am learning the same thing that my great grandfather, Nataleb Gafanovich, that he learned in Kubishak in the shtetl in Kubishak. I'm learning the same thing. Like, how, how much more can you ask for that? Oh, oh.
Wir <laughs> die alle es hier in Bayer haben, wird nur getracht, du hast aber gehört, das sag mal, wie jeder hat aber gesagt, euch werdet noch mehr Kadis suchen, euch werdet noch mehr lernen, ein paar Mischnaies. In Bemeile sehen wir, als kein größere Sach, wie wir wird sie geben von die Kedusche, dem Limit der Dafa Yomi kann größere Sikuren, kann größere Askure, kann schönere mit Zeile kämpfen, sei es wegen nicht sein. One of the jobs of the OU is to really support those who are the grass tops, the Rabban and the leaders of each and every shul, so that they can transform the grassroots, they can transform their Balabat and their community. And what we do with the help of Rabbi Elephant and with the various tools that we have is to take the Dafa Yomi experience and make it a three-dimensional, a substantive experience. And we're so honored to partner with the Aguda, with the Siyam Hashas, and with the new tools that we're going to be employing for the next, uh, next round of the DAF. The passion, the dynamism, the excitement to see people come alive through the experience of the give and take of the, the Shakla Vitaria of the DAF Yomi. Not only that, but to see people get exposed to areas of Shas and areas of Yedias that they've never ever known, that they've never experienced, that's a Gishmak. Tonight is a very important night in the lives of many people, certainly in the lives of the Magidi Shurim, in the lives of the Loim Daf Yomi, and also in the lives of the people who are going to be now starting again and starting for the first time. And all of us together should take this moment to reflect what the Aguda has done on our behalf, to be the Chsanya Shaltaira for the Siyam Ashas, for the Loim Daf Yoimi, and to take a moment to thank Hashem, Shechiyonu V'Kimonu V'Giyonu Vazmanazeh, and use it as a moment for Tefillah La'osid, that all of us together, Gesundta Hate, should be Messiah Mashas in seven and a half years again. <laughs> עכשיו שאני מוצא את השטר של ראובן ואני בא לנותן ואומר מצאתי, הוא אומר כן כן כבר נתתי לו לפני שנתתי לשמעון. והרי בבריא, כיוון שהוא לא יכול לחזור בו, אז הראשון זכה. זה שקיבל ראשון זכה בשטר, במתנה. ואז הוא יגיד, השטר של ראובן תסתכלו, מתי נכתב? בראש חודש ניסן. שמעון אם הוא יוציא שטר, נכתב בראש חודש אייר. A hard sugya becomes easy. I think any Magid share is struck by the, invariably how there always seems to be a connection between the daf that one is saying and a concept that's found in that week's parsha. You have to have three, three people. The Gemara will explain exactly what the three people are. Gezeles v'chabolas b'shloisha. Any kind of damages, any kind of theft is also b'shloisha. Nezek. I feel like on a net this year, I'm not just saying this year. I'm learning together with a lot of people, and uh, everyone's always got something to add. You got people who know about chickens, people who know about PRs, people who know about kashras, people who know about psychology. You got people who are lawyers. Everyone's got something to add. So I'm really learning it at the year. So I prepare the concepts before, but at the year, I'm actually um, actually learning. The Chabru has become a flagship where each of us have not just become uh, friends at, through the Daf Yomi, but we've attended. Uh, brisson of children, brisson of grandchildren now, chasnas, and uh, unfortunately the other side of Levias as well. So, but we've become a family.
The principle is that the Yates Sahara can be something. What what's that terminology? Rashi says Hemadish al Khaspasa. And then you had on top of that you had Bamasayim, then another two hours. There are exceptions to that. So what does that mean? The advice of the Jewish God that the person says the Arab, the Arab young is has to pay.
May I have your attention? Due to the heavy traffic conditions on the surrounding roads and the lines waiting to get into the stadium, the program will begin shortly after the scheduled time. We ask for your indulgence. We would like as many people in the stadium in order to be able to enjoy the entire program. We will keep you further updated. Thank you. Any kind of damages, any kind of theft is all. Why in the case? It says he went in front of his children who are about to pay him. Something else? Right? We have something else? I'm a Rebbe Shimon. So outside, the Rebbe Shimon says, Achazu, Achazu, let me tell you. It's Ila, it's Pigo, it's not supposed to be an Ila. Ish, Mekadish, Boga Shalucha. The principle is that we await Sahara to meet us. For Lafika, the Rebbe Shimon, the Gamliel Lamali. What, what's that terminology? Rashi says, Hemadish al Khaspasa. I do. As when it's tired, men are mid the high shit. And then you had on top of that, you had Mamasayim, then another two hours. Well, Adam Lida. Shab Makuriz, but it's done kaha. there are exceptions to that. So what does that mean? The advice of the Jewish God and the person says the Arab, the Arab Yanko is on me, he has to pay for it. Esther, who is that?
guests with disabilities and those who may require additional assistance in the event of evacuation, please notify a member of the event staff. Elevators and escalators will not be used during evacuation. Given staff will be available to guide and assist you as you walk calmly out and away from the stadium. Please do not congregate with the plaza areas and continue to the outermost sections of the parking lots. Thank you for being prepared in advance to respond promptly in an emergency. Enjoy your time at Malone Stadium. Es <laughs>
You know, Baruch Hashem, I could learn. You have to be a people person in order to learn. You just can't... Uh, 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 you can't uh, just learn by yourself without communicating with other people. That was my disability. That was that was the beginning of that was my disability. And I had a lot of setbacks, but but now it's it's uh, it's uh, it's it's part of my life. It's uh, it's like food. Yeah, ha I have to do it in order to live. You know, you know, I I can't live without it. But. Uh, the learning is, uh, you know, is a uh, is a big part of my life. unless you do kiddush yadayim raglayim from the kiyor. Now, where was the kiyor? Between the Mizbeach and... Between the Mizbeach and Koshka. So it was all the way there, at the other end of the Azara, just in front... Uh, just in you would think that when you, that when you start Daf Yomi, you, you're doing it to be Kivei Yit and Lotaira, but the Daf Yomi is actually Kivei your life, because the Daf Yomi builds on you and the Torah, the, 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 your children and your family see that you have a commitment to Torah, and that builds on your life, and every day gets more and more and more that commitment, and therefore you as a person change. And obviously for our children, we're trying to have, you know, we want them to be raised to, uh, you know, to love Torah and to love mitzvahs and to have a relationship with Hashem. So role modeling and, you know, living that way ourselves is the greatest way to, to raise our children. I see a very big impact on my family in the last past 20 years that they see their father going out every night to learn. It, it, it gives me a lot of pleasure to see that my kids have, are, are really... Shepping nachas from their father to see that they, that the father sits down and learns every day. It's something that I'm giving over to them that they can see. Yes, this is something that a person who's out there in the working world can still sit down and, and, and have time for learning. <laughs> שם הריון, כמו ילדנו רוח, זאת אומרת גם אפילו שהלידה בסופו של דבר הייתה לידה של רוח, זה נקרא, זה נקרא מעוברת, זה נקרא הריון. I think a tremendous uh, debt of gratitude goes out to the women, to the, particularly the wives of the men who are involved in this, because very often men take away time that rightfully would belong to their wives and their families, and to be on schedule for their classes at night or in the morning. And women gladly send their husbands out to do this, so any mitzvahs that accrue to the husbands and to the men for learning Torah, part of that mitzvah certainly goes to the women and they have to feel a, a sense of pride and joy in being part of this worldwide experience. For 20 years I've been going out every night and saying this year and missing my the crunch time at home, the bedtimes and the homeworks and my wife has manned that responsibility and in her schus and in the schus of thousands of other women like her, that is the, their schus helps keep the Daf Yomi dream and Limud Atar alive. A person is Moil and Kotche Hashem. Kotche Hashem comes in one of two main groups and then subgroups. The main groups of Kotche Hashem are Kotche Bereka Bayis, which is things that have...
which is the totality of our understanding and reach and desires and hope. We have to stand to the others. We have to stand to the others. One of the most important for my others is to my others. Father, I have a serious nervous. I was in this by the past scene of Shas. I saw so many of Klai Yisrael getting together being Messiah Shas. I wanted to be part of it. Since then, I've been learning Daf Yomi every day. And I've found that uh, over the past seven and a half years, the amount of Torah that, uh, Gemara that I've been able to learn uh, and retain has been significantly more than the previous seven and a half years. After the last scene of Shas, I had a uh, Cyrus to start learning Daf Yomi. I don't think I had intention to do it prior to going to the scene, but um, once I came back, it was immediate. I mean, I just started right away. Uh, I was at the scene seven years ago, and uh, it was certainly exciting. But now having it all together in one place, I think, is even more exciting. And when you start thinking about the satellites and all the different places that are that are being messiahed together, uh, it's exciting to belong to such a thing. Say. Whoever heard such beautiful words, such sweet words, Once again, we ask for your indulgence. There are still significant delays of people entering the stadium. We plan to begin the program with Mincha promptly at 7.30. Thank you for your cooperation.
um vitmen a dem sium do soll sein, dass sie kommen para die Gedeche. Ich muss euch sagen, als gerade ist heute Stammus, als hat Kufe, als Jahr nach Jahr, meint es bei uns, bei mir persönlich, ein schreckliches Überlebnis, dass er doch heute ist, wenn man umgebracht hält, und alle ihre Gedeche umgebracht, ich schiebe, ich stört, die Rossi ist hier weh, mein Gräschen Reben, der Pelzer auf, Schäm in Köln der Möhn. Der Krechts ist nicht der Fels, der Krechts ist auf Preschburg, auf Warsche, auf Lemberg, auf Krakow, auf Frankfurt, auf wo ist ein Lieben gewesen? A little more than 15 years ago in Brooklyn, Shlomi Mostovsky was Zeicha to finish Shas. He had learned Daf Yemi for seven and a half years and his wife made him a beautiful party, a siyam, and many, many friends and family attended. One of the people that attended was Shlomi's younger brother, Shalom, from Norfolk, Virginia. He was so inspired by the whole idea of his brother learning Shas, and he was inspired by what his brother had to say, what it meant to learn Shas. I was so inspired by, by hearing him talk and hearing other people talk about this, that when I came back to Norfolk, I spoke to the, to the Rav here in Norfolk, uh, Rabbi Friedman, and decided that, uh, you know, I, was, I told him I was going to start Dafyomi, and he said he was going to join me, and through that we had other people joining, and from that we've, we're about to finish our second cycle of Dafyomi here in Norfolk, Virginia. One of the people in that group was an 80-year-old man, Mr. Bernie Schloss, Hashem should bless him. Imagine an 80-year-old fellow has finished Shas twice. When I first started doing Daf, uh, I was coming early in the morning and doing a little learning by myself, and Sholem Mostovsky asked me to join the group, and I did. I think people see us sitting here every single morning before they come to shul. When they come in, they see us sitting there. I think it just inspires everybody else. You know, whatever they're learning, it could be you know, an English safer, it could be you know, with Chavrusa, whatever it is, people are coming to the shul and learning. When you have a group of people every single day coming and making a commitment of learning, I think it just inspires other people and it's just bringing everyone else out to learn also. Hakori has a Megillah Lemafreya if somebody reads the Megillah backwards. So he starts off with Haman getting hung and then, all the way, then he goes all the way back to um, Esther becoming queen. Lo Yotze has not fulfilled his obligation. Kroal Pef, he read the Megillah by heart. Kroal Targum, or if he read the translation of the Megillah. The first day of Elo is going to be Rosh Hashanah for Maisa Behema. When you tithe your animals, you're going to need to make sure that this year's animals don't get mixed up with last year's animals. When is Rosh Chodesh? When is Rosh Hashanah for that? First day of Elo, Rebbe Lazar, Rebbe Shimon Omrim, Be'echa Betishre. And Rebbe Lazar, Rebbe Shimon. What I gained from this year is that now when I look up other Gemaras, where I'm learning other things throughout the day. As this is not my main focus of the day, I'm in Kailu and I learn two other, two other starim. But when a Taisvis or other Rishayinim or a Shail Satshuva Sefer will bring down the Gemaras, especially now we're learning Kachim, which are fl far flung, and especially Krisus, Bukhairis, the Tamura, these Gemaras. So now I know what the Gemara is talking about, I know what the Rishayinim are talking about, I have a greater understanding of what is uh, what the Achreinim and the Paiskim are trying to bring as proofs or as questions to their idea and content. They eventually went out, they had a din, Mi'ilo du Rabbonon, but ultimately, since the Beis Hamikdash got some revenue out of it, they were able to go and sell it and water the grass. Today they would go and sell it in Eichler's with a big sign of it, the Dam from the Kabarnas is a big... Uh, that is tiny, it's a small amount, and it becomes mixed into a larger amount and it becomes bottle. The question is, if it's mixed together with more of that same type, can it become, can it be revitalized and make things tummy? We talked about this at two different levels. One is, if it's mixed with something of the same type, Good evening. Ruchim Abayim. On behalf of a good Israel of America, Welcome to the 12th CM Ashas of Daf Yomi. Please find your seats. Mincha will begin in two minutes, led by Rav Yaakov Levovitz, Rosh Yeshiva of Yeshiva Givat Shoal in Yerushalayim.
Mincha can be found on page 207, page 207 of the Hasiyah magazine. Mizrach is in the direction of the seating section, directly behind the stage. We ask those seated near the Mechitza curtains in Concourse 3 to please assist in drawing the curtains for Mincha. Thank you. Once again, we are now beginning Mincha. We ask for the curtains in Concourse 3 to be drawn for the entire Mincha. Thank you. Yes, <laughs> 
בלמו דברו כרוסי וימליך מלכוסי ויצמח פה קונה וקורב משיחי בחיי חיינו ויומי חיינו וחיי דכל בייס ישראל בגולו וזמן קורב אמרו אמן יהי שמי רבו מבורך עולם לא מי אומיו יספורך וישתבח ויספור וישרימם וישנשאי וישהדור וישעלה וישהלול שמי תקודשו בריחו לילו מנקור ברכוסו ושירוסו תוש ברכוסו ונחמוסו ואמירון בולמו ואמרו אמן
ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו ואלוהי אבויסנו אלוהי אברהם אלוהי יצחוק ואלוהי יעקב האל הגדול הגיבור והנירו אל אליון גויים אל חסודים טובים וקיני הכל וזכר חסדי אבויס ומביא גוי אל לבני בניהם למען שמוי באהבו מלך עוזר ומשיע ומוגן ברוך אתו אדוני מוגן אברהם אתו גיבור לא אלום אדוני מחיי מייסים אתו רב לא הושיע מוריד התול מחלקל חיים בחסד מחיי מייסים ורחמים רבים סוימך נופלים ורופי חולים ומתיר אסורים ומקיים אמונו סוי לשני עופו מי חומוי חובה וגבורויס ומי דוי מלוך מלך מימיס ומחיה ומצמיח ישועו ונאמון עתו לחיו ישמיסים ברוך עתו אדוני מחיי המיסים נקדישוך ונעריצוך בנוי המשיח סוי צרפי קודש המשלשים לכל קדושו ככוסו ביד נביאכו וקורו זה אל זה ויאמר קדוש 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 אדינוי צבאויס מלא יכול לאורץ כבודוי לומסום משבחים ואומרים ברוך כבוד אדינוי ממקיימוי ובדברי קודשך כסוב לאמור אם לא איך אדוני לא אלום אלי הייך ציון לדור ודור הללויה אתו קדוש ושמך קדוש וקדושים בכל יום יהללו חוסר לו כי אל מלך גדול וקדוש אותו ברוך אתו אדוני הואל הקדוש אתו חוינן עוד עומדס ומלמד לנויש בינו חוננו מאיתך חוכמו בינו ודועס ברוך אתו אדוני חוינן הדועס השיבנו אוהבינו לסיר עושך וקרבנו מלכנו לעבוד עושך והחזירנו בשובו שלמו לפניך ברוך אתו אדוני הרוצה בשובו סלח לנו אבינו כי חוטאנו מחר לנו מלכנו כי פושנו כי אל תוי וסלוך אותו ברוך אתו אדוני חנון המרבה לסלוח ראינו ועוניינו וריבו ריבנו וגולנו גולו שלמו מהירו למען שמך כי אל גויל חזוק אותו ברוך אתו אדוני גויל ישראל רפואנו אדוני ונר רופאי הושיענו ונבושי או כיסי לעשינו אותו ועלי ארוחו ומרפא לכל תחלוינו ולכל מחויבינו ולכל מכויסינו כי אל מלך רופאי נאמון ורחמון אותו ברוך אתו אדוני רויפי חולי עמו ישראל בורי חולנו אדוני אלוהינו אס השונו הזויס ואס כל מיני סבוסו לטובו ושם רוחו פני הודמו וסבנו מטובו ובורך שנוסנו כשונים הטובויס לברוכו כי אל טוב ומיטיב אותו אותו ומבורך השונים ברוך אתו אדוני מבורך השונים תקע בשפרו גדול לחירוסנו, ושא נס לקבץ גולוי עשינו, וקבצנו יחד מהירו, מהבא, כנפו ישרו אצל ארצנו, ברוך אתו אדוני. מקבץ נדחי עמו ישראל. 
הושיבו שופטינו כבר אישנו, ויועצינו כבת חילו, ואוסר ממנו יגון ואנוכו, ומלא יכולנו מרוע תואר עינוי לבדכו בחסד וברחמים, וצדקנו בצדק ובמשפט, ברוך אתו אדוני. מלך אויב צדקו ומשפט. ולמה על שינים אל תעשי כבר, וכל רישוק רגע יבייבייד, וכל אויבי המוחו מירו יקורסו, ואז עדים מירו סעקרוס, שבירוס, מגרוס, חלימוס, אשפילימוס, אחניהם, במהרו ויומנו, ברוך אתו אדוני. שובר אויבים ומכניע זדים. על הצדיקים ועל החסידים ועל זקני שאיריס עמכו בייס ישראל ועל פלייטס בייס סופריהם ועל גרי הצדק ועולנו ימו נורך עמךו אדוני אלוהינו ושאין סוחו טוב לך ביתכם ושמחו באמס ושאין חלקנו עמוהם ולא אילון לא נבויש כי וחוב אותוכנו ועל חזכו הגדול באמס נשוננו ברוך אתו אדוני משעון ומבטוח לצדיקים. ולי ירושלים עיר רחוב ברחמים תושוב, ושכוין בשיחו כאשר דיברתו, ובני לא יסוח בקרוב בימינו בניין עולם, וכיסא דוד עבדכו מהרו לשיחו תוכין, ברוך אתו אדוני. בני ירושלים. אס צמח דוד עבדכו מהרו סצמיח. וקרנו יתורו מישהו עשיך, כי לישהו עשיך קיווינו כל היום ומצפים לישוע, ברוך אתו אדוני. מצמיח קרן ישוע. אובו רחמון, שמע קוילנו אדוני אלוהינו, חוס ורחם עולנו, וקבל ברחמים וברצוי נס תפילותינו, כי אל שימי התפילות וסחנו נמאותו, ומלפניך מלכנו ריקו מעל תשיבנו, חנינו וענינו שמע תפילותינו, כי אתו שימי התפילה סקופה עמכו ישראל ברחמים, ברוך אתו אדוני. שימי התפילה. רצי אדוני אלוהינו בעמכו ישראל ולספילסום שאי ואושי ועשו אבידו לדביר בישכו. ואישי ישראל וספילסום מהירו בעבור סקבל ברצוין וסהיל רצוין תמיד אבידס ישראל עמךו. וסך הזה נועינינו בשובכו לציון ברחמים. ברוך אתו אדוני. המחזיר שכינוסוי לציון. מועדים אנחנו לו, שעתו הוא אדוני אלוהינו ואלוהי אביסינו לעולם ועד. צורנו צור חיינו מוגן אישנו עתו הוא לדור ודור. נדע לכל נצפר תלעשיכו על חיינו המסורים ביודיכו ועל נשמעיסנו הפקודה יסלוך. ועל ניסיכו שבכל יום עמנו ועל נפלו יסיכו ותאיבו יסיכו שבכל עש ערב ובוקר וצהריים, הטוב כי לא יכול לרחמך, והם רחם כי לא יסמו חסודך, כי מעולם קיווינו לך, ויעל כולו מזבורך וישרימם מסנשאי שמחו מלכנו תמיד, לעולם ועד, וכל החיים ירדו חסר לו, ויהללו ויבורכו את שמחו הגדול באמס לעולם כי טוב, הואל ישועשנו ועזרשנו סלו, הואל הטוב, ברוך אתו. אדוני, הטוב שמך ולכו נואל אוי דויס. שים שלום טובו וברכו, חי עם חן וחסד ורחמים עלינו ועל כל ישראל עמךו. בוכנו אבינו כלונו כאחד באור פניךו, כי באור פניךו נוסעתו לנו, אדוני אלוהינו, תירס חיים ואבס חסד, וצדקו וברכו ורחמים וחיים ושלום. וטוב יהיה בעיניך ולבורכנו ולברך את כל עמך ישראל בכל עש ובכל שעה בשלמך ברוב עז ושלום ברוך אתו אדוני המברך את עמו ישראל בשלום יסכדל ויסכדי שמי רבם 
Bilma divro kiusei, viamlich mal husei, viatzmach bukonei, vikorei vmeshichei. Vchaye choi, nu vyoi me choi, nu vchaye de chobeis Yisrael, vagolov zman kore vim ruame. Yesh me rabo me vorach, yolam lo me omayom. Yisporach, yishtabach, yispoar, yisrimam, yisnasei, yishador, yisalev, yishalor, shmei kukutsha berechu. Leila, minko bechasa, vishirasa, tush bechasa, vnechemasa, damiran balma, vimru, amen. Tiskabal, tzlai soy nuvo, soy nuvo, beis Yisrael, kodom avu hain di vishmaya, vimru, amen. Yehei shlomo rabo min shmaya, v'chayim toivim oleinu, v'al kol Yisrael, v'imru amein. Oi se shalom bim reimov, hu yase shalom oleinu, v'al kol Yisrael, v'imru amein. Oleinu l'shabay ha'ach v'adoin ha'koyol, l'osei skudulo l'yotzeh b'reishis, שלא יעשו לנו כאילו, עצו יעשו לנו כאילו, עצו יעשו לנו כאילו, שלא 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 יעשו כי המלכו שלך היא אומר את המלכו חלבו את יעשו בשר עשיך אדי נוי אם לא יכלו אילום ועד ונאמר ויו אדי נוי למלך על כל הורץ ויו אמא הוא יהיה אדי נוי אחד ושמו אחד יסקדל ויסקדש שמי רבו ביומו דברו כעושי וימליך מלכוסי ויצמח פה קונה וקורב משיחי. בחיי חיין ובימי חיין ובחיי דחור בייס ישראל בגולו ובזמן קורא ואמרו אמן. יש מי רבו מבורך לעולם לא מיום היום יספורך וישתבח ויספור וישרימם וישנשאי וישהדור וישעלה וישהלול שמי תקודשו בריחו לילו מנקו בחוסו ושירוסו תוש בחוסו ונחמוסו דמירון בולמו ואמרו אמן יהי שלמה רבו מן שמיו וחיים טובים עלינו ועל כל ישראל ואמרו אמן. אוי שא שלום במרימיו הוא יעשה שלום עלינו ועל כל ישראל ואמרו אמן. We ask everyone to remain standing for the recitation of Tehillim, Kapitel Kuf Lamed, led by Rabbi Yaakov Rechnitz, as a schus for Choyle Yisrael, for our precious brethren in Eretz Yisrael, and for Yidin wherever they may be, for Gezund, Parnasa, Shiduchim, children or freedom from unjust imprisonment. The Tehillim can be found on page 202, of the Hasiyim magazine. Following the Tehillim, Rabbi Rechnitz will say a Mishaberech for Choylem and will pause briefly at the appropriate point to insert the names of specific Choylem you wish to have in mind. She Hamalois. Mi mama kim krosi ho adoi noi. A 
Adoinoi shimo bekoili tienos necho kashu voice le koil tachanunai. Ima voino istishmo ya. Adoi noi mi amoi. Ki im kho asli kho leman ti vorei. Si adoi noi ki v'son avshi v'lid v'oroi oi cholti. Nafshi l'adoi noi mi shoi merim l'aboi ker Shoi merim la boi ker. Yachel Yisroel el adoi noi. Kim adoi noi a chesed vabei moi fedus. Yiftes Yisroel Mikoy Lavoy Noyson Achenu Kolbeis Yisroel Anasun Matsor Vashib Oim Dimei Mayumayim Vashu Hamok Yunachem Alim Vitsi Mitsor Olin Vachu Meafeil Oli Yoyr Omishibud Ligulo Hashto Bagolo Vizman Kori Vimayman Omein מי שבין אחד ויסיין אברהם יצחק ביעקו עם מוישה ענדוב דשלוימו סור רבקו רוחב עליה הוא יבורך וירפס כל חולה ישרוער Bavu shikola kola mispalim bavuram Vizchaza kodish borchu yimolin achim aleyem Lachlimam lana poisom Lachachzikom lachayoisom Vizchlach lemimim efirush lem shmaim Lachol ivoneim uchol gideim Nifuas hanefesh Nifuas haguf Hashto bagolov izman kori Vinoimar omeim Please give your attention to Rabbi Chaim David Zwiebel, Executive Vice President of Agudath Israel of America. Ruchum Aboyim, B'Shem Hashem, on behalf of Agudas Yisrael of America, which has the schus to serve as the, the achsanya to this historic gathering of Kovet Atayra and Kovet Shomayim, it is my pleasure to welcome each and every one of you who have braved the elements and the traffic and whatever other mechshaylais may have arisen to gather en masse and join us here tonight for this remarkable maimed in this 100th year since the founding of the Agudas Yisrael movement in Katowice by the great Gedalia Yisrael, what a privilege and a schus it is for Agudas Yisrael to be the Balach Sanya here tonight and to bring people together from Allah Shichten and Allah Kreisen. 
It's a tremendous honor, and we thank you all for being part of it. It is now my pleasure to call upon Reb Eli Kleinman, who in addition to all of his other undertakings on behalf of the Klal has served so ably as the chairman of this Siyam Hashas. And I'll call upon Rebelli to deliver opening remarks. Bershus, Gedaile Ma'ire Hadar. Bershus, Rivervice Alpha Yisrael. Bruchem Abayim B'Shem Hashem. Welcome to the 12th Siyam Hashas of Dafayaymi. Baruch Shechiyanu V'Kiyamanu V'Giyanu Lazman Hazer. Marei V'Rabaisai, we are about to commence an indisputably historic Maimid L'Chvayda Taira. First and foremost, I would like to wish a Hartzog Mazel Tov to the Messiahim, the Magidei Shir, and their respective families for this staggering accomplishment. Spanning seven and a half years and 2,711 dafim. Zehayim Osa Hashem, Nagila Venismachavai. What a remarkable journey it has been to arrive at this phenomenal moment of Simcha Satira. It all starts in 1923 at the first Knessia Gedoil of Agudas Yisrael in Vienna, with Rav Meir Shapiro. Zechet Sadeh for Kaddish Lebracha, introducing the concept of Dafa Yaimi. Rapidly, the idea takes root, creating achdus and learning throughout Klal Yisrael. The Loim Diadaf go through two Machzairim until European Jewry is brought to the brink of destruction by the Nazis, Yamach Shimon Vizichram. I'd like to tell you, if I may, a short story about how one particular family dealt with the impending devastation. On a Shabbos afternoon in 1944, in the small town of Kerestor, Hungary, just before its Yidin were forced into the ghetto, Maizeda, Rav Elimelech Fishman Zatzal, Hashem Yinkam Domai, the Gaba to the great Tzaddik in Baal Moifis, Rav Shaila Kerestira, Zechusa Yogain Aleinu, called over his son, Yabadal Achayim Toivim, my uncle, Rabbi Yosef Fishman, and the visiting Einikol, Zolze Leibin and Gezinsein. My Zayda said, terrible things are coming, and we don't know what the future holds. Lamelern in a blot Gemara. We must have three diarists learning together so that no matter what happens, Tyra won't be destroyed. He quoted a Gemara in Bava Metzia. Amarav Parnach, Amarav Yaichanan, Kalshu Talmud Chacham, Uvnoi Talmud Chacham, Uven Benoi Talmud Chacham, Shuvain Taira Pesekes Mizarei Leoilam, Shinemar, Vani Zeis Brisi, Lo Yemushu Mipicha, Mipi Zaracha, Mipi Zera Zaracha, Amar Hashem Meyato Viyad Oilam. If someone is a Talmud Chacham as well as his son and his grandson, the Taira will remain with them and future generations forever. Taisvis and Ksuvis refers to this Gemara and explains the concept of the Chut HaMeshulash, a three-ply cord which does not easily break. Taisvis elucidates, Kivin Sh'adam Laimed, Hu Uvenai, Uven Benai, Mikan Ve'elech, Taira Chayzeres, Alach Sanya Shalom. Once Taira takes a firm hold in a family, it never departs. Marai Virabaisai, this is what was going through my Zayda's mind as he faced a terrible fate to be Meiser Nefesh and protect the Torah HaKadosh. Not long afterward, Maizeda and his family found themselves in a cattle car to Auschwitz. It was Shavuos night, and he managed to take two Bilkalach with him. Over the clatter of the wheels and the wailing of the children, he quieted the car and announced he was going to make Kiddush for everyone. It was the last time he would ever make Kiddush as the train sped through the night to take him to his final destination to be murdered al Kiddush Hashem in the gas chambers of Auschwitz. But Torah was not destroyed. We are here tonight because the Torah has Nitzchias.
It had a firm hold in the family of Klal Yisrael, and as such, Klal Yisrael rebuilt from the Kivshon Ha'esh. It's because of those that died al Kiddush Hashem, and the Sheiris that played the Eden were sacrificed their all for Torah, that we are here 89 years after the Daf's initiation. Could Rav Meir Shapiro have imagined then that we would be here tonight, 92,000 strong Kane Yerbu? Plus, upwards of 100 cities around the world connected by a satellite to Ish Echad Belev Echad. Could he have imagined being Makadish Shem Shemayim in a sports stadium, transformed into a giant Makam Kaddish for the largest Siyam in history, Makalois Rivervois Amcha Beis Yisrael? Rabbi Say, his dream is not only alive, it's stronger than ever. As the chairman of the Siam, I must express Hakara Satoiv to an extraordinary group of people. It took two years of hard work to put the Siam together. The working group was comprised of a highly dedicated group of Balabatim and Aguda staff. There are too many names to mention, but I must mention a few. Amongst Balabatim, the devoted and determined co-chairman, Rav Shmuel Yosef Reeder, as well as co-chairman, Rav Rafal Hertzka, and our chairman of the Patrons Committee, Rav Shlaima Werdiger, who was essential to so many Paratim of the Siam. Also thanks to the Dafyami Commission Chairman, Rabbi Gedalia Weinberger, and our MC tonight, Reb Shloyme Yehuda Rechnitz. And of course, the entire staff of Agudas Yisrael of America, who worked tirelessly to guarantee the success of this monumental undertaking, under the able direction of Rabbi Shlomo Gertzlin, who served as Chief Operating Officer of the SEAM. In addition, I wish to recognize the more than 16,000 Masmide HaSeam, Kindelach, who learned Lilu Nishmas, the 1.5 million children exterminated in Churban Europa. <laughs> Likewise, on behalf of the CM organizers and all of us attending tonight, I thank the administration and staff of MetLife Stadium for their utmost cooperation in assembling this enormous event. Rabbi Sai, Tyra unites us. Tyra defines us. Tonight, we synthesize the two manifestations of Tyra with a single event. This Siyam, the premise and promise of Dafa Yoimi, was and is Achtos in Klal Yisrael. Take a look around. There is a cross section of Klal Yisrael represented here tonight. Svardim, Ashkenazim, Modern Orthodox, Hasidish, Yeshivish, and the thousands of Balei Tshuva that are present. All kinds of yarmulkes and hats. Kulonu Ke'echad. All of us children of Avinu Shabashimayim, presenting Allah the Abishta's Kinder. This was the beauty behind the Lublina Rav's revolutionary concept that Klal Yisrael is on the same page, literally and figuratively. You know, many people have asked me what happens the day after the Siyam. The answer is simple. We turn the page. As one of the Messiah men this evening, I invite those of you who are not yet Loimde Daf Yoimi to join us. Make the commitment, take the journey, and be part of the experience of learning throughout Shas. It inspires you to not only learn the daf, but other limudim as well. If we use this siyam as an opportunity to be mechazik ourselves in limud ha with the kayach harabim, we can continue to scale ever greater heights. Lahadil Torah u lahadira. Tonight is a night of inspiration and opportunity of his iris and his chachis. We stand proudly, Baraiv Am, Biachtus, 
and declare to the Rabbi Nishalaylam that Klal Yisrael is one. And like the Malachim, we are gathered Lahaktish Liyitzram, Benachas Ruach, Besafa, Vrura, Venima, Kedusha, Kulam, Ke Echad. May we be Zaychet Taka to the Bias Mashiach Tzidkenu, Bemeheir of Yemenu, and to all be Messiah Shas together in Yerushalayim, Ir HaKodesh. Rabbi Sai, Tonight's theme is dedicated by Mr. and Mrs. J. and Jeannie Schottenstein, in memory of Mr. Jerome Schottenstein. <clears throat> Yaakov Meir Chaim Ben Ephraim Eliezer Hakoyen, Oliver Shalom. Please direct your attention to the screens around the stadium. Thank you. This is our family legacy. And to me, and to my father, and the rest, and my wife, and my mother, and my sons, to be able to have our name associated with Torah, and to be able to sit here tonight, and know there's 90,000 people in this stadium, knowing the hundreds of thousands of people that use the Gomorrahs on a daily basis, there is no greater honor for a Jew than this. It is truly fitting that this evening is dedicated to the memory of the man who had the vision to share the vision and his son who inspired that vision. And we owe them a great debt of gratitude for what they have made possible for our generation and for future generations. When I went up to uh, Mr. Schottenstein and I said I want to thank you for my life. I couldn't have done it without your, your divorce. I, I couldn't have done it. I just couldn't have done it. I said, it's opened up a world for me. And I know when I'll be saying the Kaddish and looking out, I'll be thinking of my father and I'll be thinking about uh, my father's vision. And even though I think my father knew what it could be and what it would be, but for me to be able to see it and see it in my lifetime and see the acceptance and to see how it's changing people's lives. Most people, when they do something in their life, they don't have an opportunity to see what the results will be. So to be able to see this and bear witness to the results of what my father started and what our family has participated in, it's truly a great blessing from Hashem. We all share in a bracha to Jay and Jeannie that in the unprecedented schus of the Torah they have and continue to make possible to the entire spectrum of Kla Yisrael, they be blessed with abundant good health, nachas and simcha, and that together May we all be zeichet to be mekabel penei Mashiach tzedkenu b'meheira b'yamenu. The schus of having such an incredible oven on as we have here tonight. A dais of admirim, Rashi Yeshiva, Rabbanim, Magide Shir, close to 1,500 of the Manhige Adar and the Marbitze Taira and Klal Yisrael. What a special schus. At the same time, there were many who wanted to participate, but for various reasons were not able to, but sent their brachas, whether in writing or over the telephone, just a few minutes before the Siyam began, we received a very special letter from the Skolena Rebbe. It's a little bit of a lengthy letter of bracha, but I'll just mention a few words. Thank you 
l'smeichem b'simchas ha'toyre b'siyem ha'shas, v'gam l'rabbeis l'chol eila ha'buam u'mekabel ma'leim kabul es toyves li'ishtatif me'ato b'lim ha'shas, u'lahaschol mechudosh machzer abu aleinu l'toyve. It's my pleasure now to call upon Shlomo Yehuda Rechnitz of Los Angeles, a noted Askin who will serve as the master of ceremonies for tonight's program, Rabbi Shlomo Yehuda Rechnitz. Bereshus, Zikne Adar, Admoirim, Rashi Yeshiva, Rabonim, Misaimi Ashas, Avi Moiri, Moiri Chami, the River Voice Alpha Israel. Ashrei Ayin Rasa Kolele. Fortunate is the person who sees, who experiences this great gathering. Let me attempt to describe to you the breathtaking view from where I stand. Almost 100,000 Yidin, all with different minhagim, different traditions, different rabbeim, different mahalchim in the Avayis HaKodesh, all here for but one purpose, the purpose of Kavad HaTayra, Ki Ish Echad, Belev Echad. What a tremendous display of achtus. What a massive demonstration of Kiddushem Shemayim. Imagine what Reb Meir Shapiro or the Chavetz Chaim would have given to witness this beautiful Maimed. Think of what the Admirum of previous Deirs would have sacrificed to take part of such an unprecedented event. Imagine the Simcha of Abayi Verova, the joy of Ravina and Ravashi. Try to visualize the singing and the dancing that's going on right now in Shemayim. The Amirayim, the Rishonim and Achreinim, all from small towns in Shtetlach, as they watch tens of thousands being Messiahim, all the Mesechtas that they toiled on so diligently. There are the six million Kedoshim. It's so hard, so difficult to comprehend. Adults, children, young and old, whose sheer quantity could have filled up more than 60, yes, 60 of these stadiums, annihilated all our Kiddush Hashem. And now they watch us from Shemayim with immense pride as they are reunited with their Heilige Kindelach and Shepping Nach is from their legacy that we continue to rebuild. Yes, imagine all the Dairis, their tears of joy, that despite Churban after Churban, where our foes were determined to forever destroy the last Blat Gemara, along with the unwavering Yid who had to be ripped away from his Shtender, yet here we are, the Tairak Daisha leapt, Klal Yisrael leapt, He has taken this moment. We're gathered in a stadium that is literally showcasing Anu Mashkim Vehem Mashkim, Anu Ratzim Vehem Ratzim, the places that we run to and the places that they run to. Incidentally, on this very day in 1936, on August 1st, the Summer Olympics began in Berlin in the newly built Alim Stadion with a similar capacity of 100,000 people. It was there that Adolf Hitler, Yimach Shemoy Vizichroy, was saluted and applauded while opening up the Olympics. He knew the whole world was watching as he addressed the crowd spewing hatred and anti Semitism. How sweet is our revenge! that tonight in the stadium, 76 years later, 
100,000 Yidin come together to celebrate Avas Hinam, love and Avas Taira. Anu rotsim l'chayi o'ilam abo v'heim rotsim l've'er shochas. But what koyach does Kalal Yisrael have that makes us so unique? The Torah describes how Esav came to his father Yitzchak when he discovered that Yaakov Avinu had received the brachas and he pleaded, Barcheni gamoni ovi, tate father, bench me as well. Yitzchak answered him, I already gave the brachas to Yaakov. So Esav cried, Habrocha acha silacha? Do you only have one bracha? But it was too late. Yaakov had already received the brachas. To which every boy in Cheder asks, Rebbe, why couldn't Yitzchak just give Esav a different bracha? Why couldn't he give him a bracha for Parnassah, for healthy children? Are there a shortage of brachas? The answer is Al Pidrush that Esav didn't want just any bracha. Vayoyimer Esav el Aviv and Esav said to his father, Habracha achas ilcha. Esav wanted the bracha of achas, the bracha of one, the bracha of unity, the bracha of achdus. Esav knew very well that if Yaakov Avinu and the Bnei Yisrael have achdus, there was no way he could ever defeat them. When we have achdus, there is no way we can ever be defeated, not physically by our enemies and not spiritually by our Yetzirah. And what makes us one? What unites us? Av Echad. We all have one. We all have one father. Whether we live in Eretz Yisrael or in Chutz Laretz. Whether we wear a black hat, a strimal, a kippah suga, or a baseball cap. We all have one father. The love, the caring that we feel for each other is immeasurable. Whether it's davening for a chayla a few thousand miles away, or sending some of our hard-earned money to a broken or destitute family that needed our help. We all have one father. The responsibility, the arvus that we feel for one another is nothing short of true brothers. Be it worrying that no Bas Yisrael has to cry herself to sleep every night, wondering if she's ever going to find her Bashert, or relentlessly petitioning for our brothers in Postville, Bolivia, and North Carolina. Yes, Avech. We all have one father. It's interesting, all of us from all walks of life are constantly looking for schoolists and schusim. There's nobody who can claim that they don't need some sort of Yeshua. And there are thousands of schoolists, there are countless Gemaras that teach us what one can do to attain bracha. There are schools for Parnassah, healthy children, Bodem Tamidei Chachamim, Rifuas, Shiduchim, long life, Shalom Bayis, and the list goes on and on. But after all those Gemaras, and after all those Mepharshim, the final Mishnah in Shas, the last halach of Torah Shabal Peh teaches us something so fundamental and integral, yet states it differently than is ever found in any other Mishnah. 
You see, usually a Mishnah Gemara will tell you something you can do or say to be granted Yeshua one is seeking. But that may be just one of many ways. For example, who doesn't know of a plethora of schools for one's Parnassah? Yet this Mishnah, the final Mishnah states it differently because it states it in the negative or to the exclusion that there is only one way. Loi Matzah Hashem Kli Machzik Brachal Yisrael. The Abishter was not able to find any way or any vehicle to house Bracha for the Eden, Elo HaShalim, except through Shalim. You can say a special Tfilis and Piyutim, you can go to Mekayim Yisak for 40 days and 40 nights, and you can get stuck with special Kavanis, and it'll all work in some level of understanding. And yes, Ashrecha V'Tayvlach, but if you want sustained Bracha, if you want to keep bracha, if you want to own bracha, if you want it to be yours, if you want to be machzik bracha like the Mishnah says, lo yimotza Hashem kli, there is no other way. The Abishter didn't find it, and we surely won't. Ella hashalom, only through shalom. Shalom within our families, shalom within our communities, shalom between our communities, shalom because of our similarities, shalom, despite our differences. <clears throat> Yaakov Avinu risked his life to bring us that special bracha of achas. We need to dedicate our lives to have achas bring us that special bracha. Achai b'nei Yisrael, Today is Yud Gimel Av. Yud Gimel is Bigamatria Echad. So today is also Av Echad, or one father. Rabbi Nishalayim, Habayt Mi Shemayim Urei. Look down from Shemayim at your children. We all stand here today, Bishalom, together, united in true Achdus. We ask you, we plead with you, send us your bracha. Send us Yeshuas. No more tsar, it's too much. No more pain and suffering. No more sickness, no more poverty, no more tears. Hashem oiz la'amo yitain. Hashem yivarech es amoy vasholim. And we all daven that this siyam should pale in comparison to the next siyam ashas, where we'll be joined by all of Paul Yisrael. Bisim Kharaba in Yushalayim Irakoidish Bim Hair of Yamainu Amen. It is my schus and covet to call upon one of the Ziknei Rosh Yeshiva in America to deliver Divrei Bracha, Rosh Yeshiva, Yeshiva Philadelphia, Chavar Moyetzis Gdoyli Atoira, Harav Shmuel Kamenetsky Shlita. Yeshus, Maronon, the Rabbonon, the Rabbi Sai. It is a great schus to stand here today to congratulate every person here and every person wherever he is on this day that can honor a hundred thousand people are meeting together. As it was said before, as Chayish Echod Beleiv Echod. It's a great schus because we learn something. The Gemara tells us that Abaya says that we made, someone made a siyum, he made a Yomitov Lechabonon, Zoktrasha Lechola Talmidim. In other words, our Simcha is even those that were not Messiah. It is our Simcha. It's a Simcha for Kol Yisrael. Just want to point out 
one point. Of course, every person that learns Torah, it's his chus. But we have to know and understand that Torah was not given to any individual. Torah was given to Kol Yisroi. Was Baraye are always for not zayche to Torah. Shifte Ko for not zayche to to Kabbal Zatayra. Only when Kol Yisroi came out of Mitzrayim, ki yishechod b'leivechod, and that's what Torah was given. It seems that Torah is something rechush, rechush at sibo. It's rechush. Well, it's communal rechush. It's not the individual that learns Torah for himself. When he learns Torah and Ali in Torah, Shakua in Torah, it is a mile for Kol Yisroel. It's a chilek. Kol Yisroel is zeichet to more Torah. As the Gemara says, that Ma Pekores, Ma Anul Rabbonon, what did they, what did they accomplish? They never matter as Oirev. They never asked kosher as a poyer and teirim. What did they, what were they mechadesh? The mechadesh, the teire is not just their own. Teire belongs to Kol Yisrael. Every chover in Kol Yisrael is eches a teire. And it says, and therefore, Abaya says he made yemet tova l'rabbonon. It's a yom tova for everybody. And it is our simcha that we are zeiche klal Yisroel was zeiche to finish Talmud. My father, Zechel Lebrocha, said once that the loim day, loim day adaf, have to be mekabel more. Every person has to grow and steig and he said in Yilz Hashem, next time he learn Shas, he will learn Chaza with Tzaisvus. It's something that every person has to aim for that. Shevan Ali in Torah. Torah, every word is Torah. But we have to understand that the riches of Torah is endless. Mamesh endless. And the chiv of us to understand Torah is to go into the Torah to understand every word. And it says, and the Medrash says, when Yaakov Avinu in Parshas Vayetze, when he was going to Lovon, and on the way he saw Roim, and he says that they, were, they couldn't feed until they took all the heavy stone, they have to come together. And Chazal tell us it, it refers to Torah. It refers to Torah. Versus Kohen Levi Yisroel. Then it's finished out in Chazal that if Chazal Sholem, one person would be missing, we would not be Zeichet to Torah. That's what it says in that Medrash. Our schus of Torah is because we are part of Kohen Yisroel. As was said before, a first course, Sholem brings us together. But to Zeichet to Torah, you have to be part of Kol Yisroel. To be part of Kol Yisroel means that he's Mosul to Kol Yisroel. Mosul to Terosoi, Mosul to Kadosh Baruch Hu. I broke his to the Messiahim and to the Nesofim to be Zeichet continuously to have Nesofim l'shei mitzvah, l'shei maliyah, l'shem teiro. It is a kovet a teiro, and kovet a shem is boach. She be zeichet to many siyumim. Yeraino she be zeichet and aliyah in teire. She be zeichet. Mashiach said keino zokov bekorayv. She be zeichet. Mashiach said keino amen. We will now hear Reb Abish Brot, accompanied by Achim Brot, 
lead us in the beautiful song Kad Yasmin.
It is a COVID Rav to introduce the Roish Agudis Yisrael, Chaver Moyetzes Kedoyle Atayra, the Novominsker Rebbe Shlita. Beschuss mir Ronnen, Barabonnen, Roche Eide, Marbitze Tere, Leim de da Fayemi, Bechola Kola Kodisch Azer. Manich Bot Hayem, die Größe der Tog, Magdela Hasho, wie der Häuben ist der Moment, was wir leben alle durch jetzt. Der größte Quetsche Mayem, der riesige Simcha Satöre, was nimmt uns alle Menarem. Die Teure ist maachet alle Schichten, jeden, was gefindet sich da. Wir sind in da, wie sich nach Reus gebringt geworden, etliche Mal. Aber es ist also nicht so gepasst. Wir sind doch alle zusammengekommen, nach weit der Teure, ke ich echot, beleib echot. Also wir jeden sind gestanden bei meinem Haus zu hinein. In Demos hat man gefeiert, der Chassanif in Kutschebrichung Kevayochel mit dem Klar Israel durch die teure Hackdeutsche, was er hat eingepflanzt in uns, der Chaye, Eulam, Nota, Besecheinu. Die Jeden, bei seinem Messiah im Schass, weil er haben gelernt und sich geplockt, in der Mekheim gewinnt, die ihm besorgt, dass er schon sei. Heit ist versehen, verrinnt, Asa yei metzobe, asa simcha amuke, was mir kenn ich übergeben mit Wörter. In gelernt hat man in aller Lechönis. Im Postuk steht, beiber ayade in beeretz moyev, heul moische beeres atöre aseis leimer. Sogt rashi beschivim loschen pirschulahem. Steht von Chedusha Yerim, als Moshe Rabbeinu hat gesehen, als jeden wollen darf man durchmachen dem Gollus, wenn alle Schiffe um es in Reden sehre Sprachen, hat er reingetun in alle Lechöne, sagt Koyach, zu kennen sein Kehlem von Debrei Teure. Als alle Sprachen sollen kennen dienen die Teure, sollen kennen sein Mitteln, zu lernen der Heilige Teure. Und bei mir weiß ich mir doch, als der Rambam hat geschrieben und gelernt in Arabisch, in Rashi, in Französisch, in Heint lernt man auf Englisch. In CD jeden, weil ich, weil ich rede nicht kein Jiddisch. Aber ich habe gelernt teurer. Und dann gekommen Heint oben, sich mit Stadt zu sein, in Praven sehr simcher, in sehr simcher. In eine mit uns, und euch zu den Tausend der Ballet Schuwe, weil ich es eine Mekurov geworden, und während Mekurov, zur Jiddischkeit, doch nicht mehr da teure. In der Moich gelernt, in Messiah gewinnen, die Brei teure, Karl Chad, Le Pumschio de Lei. Will ich sagen, etliche Wörter, bis was am Diener. The Torah knows no barriers of language. The sanctity of Jewish souls knows no barriers of language. We are all cast out of one and the same rock. And our mission of history is of one singular purpose, to bear testimony to Hashem's presence in our midst. His commandments, his mitzvahs we perform are the sacred vessels of his presence. 
They are the body of our faith by which we act and behave. But the, the study of Torah, Hashem's heavenly vis, wisdom, is the neshama, the soul of Jewish life. Learning Torah is the nutrition of the Jewish soul. Tonight, we've all gathered here to celebrate and proclaim the ultimate meaning of our lives. Yisrael b'yerai sechadhu. The Klal Yisrael and the Torah are one inseparable entity. This is the profound message that the Siyam Ashas sends to the depths of our hearts and minds. In our commitment to the study of Torah, we commit ourselves to our existential meaning as Jews. The world does not understand us. They cannot fathom us. They cannot figure out why we continue to exist as a people when all the great empires of the past have long since perished. But we, who have persevered in history against all odds and in the most impossible conditions, know that the answer lies in the Pesach and Chumash, Ki loisi shochach mi that the Torah will not for, be forgotten from us and by us. It is the secret ingredient, the only ingredient, that makes Jewish continuity possible. Ki heim chayeinu v'erech yameinu. The Lublin Arav, Rav Meir Shapiro Zatzal, who conceived the idea of Daf Hayemi, used to say that if you open up a Vilna Shas Gemara, you see the entire panorama of Jewish history. The Mishnah from Eretz Yisroel, the Gemara from Bavel, Rashi and Teisvis from France, the Rif from North Africa, the Ran from Spain, the Rosh from Germany, the Marsha from Poland, and the Rashash from Lithuania. This sacred Shas and its dedicated unyielding students have carried us through all the ages. Its knowledge is the aspiration of all Lamde Torah, and its completion is thus a yamtiv of cosmic proportions. So despite all the tzaras and problems that afflict us, despite the enormous difficulties that face Jews everywhere, tonight is still Zman Simchaseinu, a festival of joy. Tnu kovid la Torah. Give honor to the Torah, for it is the Torah that we live for, rather the Torah that has kept us alive. So we express our joy tonight at this wonderful opportunity to gather by the many tens of thousands to proclaim to the world and to ourselves the true meaning of Jewish existence. In the words of Rav Sadia Goin, Ein uma seinu uma elebeteirosa. It is the Torah that defines us as a nation. May we all merit the privilege to grow in Torah, to learn and achieve more and more, not only to study Torah, but to be possessed by the knowledge of Torah. And this knowledge of Torah is to guide our behavior on all levels. May the words of Hashem fill our beings, uplift our lives, and make us worthy of witnessing the ultimate redemption. Please turn your attention to the jumbotrons throughout the stadium for a video presentation of a journey through the decades of the history of the Daf Hayomi.
It all began 89 years ago in Vienna, in August of 1923. It was the first Knesset Gedela, the first World Congress of Agudas Yisrael. The event brought together people from throughout Europe, including many of the greatest rabbinic leaders of the age. The Chavetz Chaim, the Ger Rebbe, Rab Chaim Oizer, the Chodkever Rebbe, the Radzina Rebbe, Rab Moshe Mordechai Epstein of Slabotka, Rab Issa Zalman of Slutsk, Rab Yosef Leib Bloch of Tells, Rab Shlomo Zalman Breuer of Frankfurt, and many, many others. The goal of the Knesset was to unite all segments of our people under the banner of Torah. And yet, there was an unexpected event at the Knesset, one that would unite our people in a way that no one had ever imagined. Rab Meir Shapiro was only 36 years old, by far the youngest of the featured speakers. He was the Rav in Sunik in Poland, a brilliant speaker, a charismatic leader, a spokesman for Torah Jews in the Sem, the Polish parliament. With a loud, clear, enthusiastic voice, he presented his idea, the Daf Yomi. He gave an example of a Jew who takes a two-week journey from Eretz Yisrael to New York, and under his arm he carries with him his Gemara, learning his Daf Yomi every day. He arrives in America, and the very first morning that he walks into a base medrash, he sees fellow Jews learning the very same daf. He happily joins them in their learning and establishes an immediate rapport with strangers who are now his chaverim. Can there be a greater expression of unity and harmony? What is more, said Rav Meir Shapiro, there are many mesechtas that very few people learn. Thanks to the daf yemi, these mesechtas would no longer be orphans. When the Chavetz Chaim heard this, he rejoiced, and he said to Rav Meir Shapiro, when you come to the Olam Ha'emes, all those lonely Masechtas will come out to greet you. His listeners at the Knesset were electrified. But would this idea take hold? Or would it just join many other wonderful and imaginative ideas in the dustbins of history? Now, it is the first night of Rosh Hashanah in the Beis Medrash of Ger. Tens of thousands of Hasidim have come to spend Rosh Hashanah with the Halega Imre Emes. That evening, the Rebbe asks his Gabbai to bring him Mesech the Brachas because he's about to start the Daf Yemi. The word spreads like wildfire. The leader of the largest Hasidus in the world is learning Daf Yemi. Within minutes, every Mesech the Brachas in Ger is in use and people are waiting in line to use them next. For the rest of the 1920s and 1930s, Daf Yemi grew more and more popular. And fittingly, the mass celebration of the first Siyam Hashas was held in 1931 in Rav Meir Shapiro's own city of Lublin. The second Siyam Hashas of Daf Yemi took place in Lublin. There were about 20,000 people assembled in Lublin, many uh, Jews of Lublin, the Talmudim of Yeshiva's Chachma Lublin, and very prestigious and very great guests. It was a great event, a great event uh, which lasted a whole day. And then came 1939, and the sun set on the Jewish world of Europe. Devastation, destruction, and desolation. And yet after the war, slowly and painstakingly, the Jewish nation began to rejuvenate, and with it, the Daf Yemi. This is the only reason why we survive as a nation. Not because the Jews survived here, or because I could escape with my father from, from the Nazi. As a nation, we survived because of this union, because of this learning of uh, the movement places. After Auschwitz, Sachsenhausen, Oranienburg, Ordruf, and Buchenwald, 
we celebrated, I together with a small, a small group of survivors of Shayos Applied to Eden, celebrated the third sea Mashas, which uh, none of us participated in or learned it. Maybe a little bit in the ghettos, but certainly not in the concentration camps. DP camp of Feldafing, where I was, they assembled and they celebrated. They had three Gimoras, three Gimoras Nidda, and about four Mesechtes, five Mesechtes, Brochus, in order to have scholar to start the fourth master of, of that learning. And of course, those Jews who were uh, chalishing uh, to, to see Yiddish oasis again and to learn, they grabbed it. And it so happened that to the sea and to the Mesebe itself, they brought these three Gimoras and our few Gemara's brothers. And here we started again. Onto the shores of America came tens of thousands of displaced Yidden. Under the leadership of Gedele Yisrael and Great Askonim, they heroically began to rebuild from the ashes, establishing Chadorim, Yeshivas, and Bate Medrash of higher learning. But what about the Balabatim, the common man? Rav Pinchas Taitz of Elizabeth, New Jersey, began teaching Gemara in Yiddish every Matzah Shabbos on the Daf HaShavua radio program. Grown men cried when they heard the sweet words of the Daf in the language they grew up with back home. Years later, Rav Meir Applebaum created Torah tapes and every Daf and Shas was now available in Yiddish and English. Rav Eli Tadabam took it a step further and initiated Dialadaf. Now, through the benefit of modern technology, thousands are able to learn the Daf at home, on the road, or during a break at the workplace. In the early 1960s, visionaries like the beloved Rabbi Baruch Borchad and the internationally known Jewish diplomat Rabbi Chaskel Besser created the Daf Yemi Commission of Agudas Yisrael. Rabbi Besser taught me that Jewish education is the key to Jewish continuity, which is why the Lauder Foundation, under Rabbi Besser's leadership, built a network of Jewish schools across Eastern Europe. But it's also true for Jewish adults. Rabbi Besser would always say that Jewish learning is a lifelong undertaking and a lifelong privilege essential to Jewish survival. That is why he invested so much time and energy in spreading the Daf Yomi. The Daf Yomi Commission provided Magide Shur to groups who needed them. They printed thousands of small Gemaras that could be taken anywhere and encouraged and hosted celebrations of completed Masechtas. Today, the Daf Yomi Commission is involved in numerous initiatives to strengthen Limit HaTayra. New translations, contemporary perushim, and annotated editions of Talmud Bavli helped further stimulate the growth of learning. As the quantity grew, so did its quality. Daf Iyun stimulated learners to further heights. Mifal Ashas and Dirshu enlisted multitudes in rigorous learning programs around the world. Following a small gathering in the Sixth Seam in the Beis Yaakov of Borough Park Dining Room, the first major public seam in New York City was held in Manhattan Center in June of 1975. Approximately 2,000 people were in attendance. Seven years later in 1982, the Felt Forum was packed with 5,000 people, with several thousand outside clamoring to get in. In 1990, Madison Square Garden was filled to capacity with over 20,000 people in attendance. The 1997 CM filled the garden once again, plus the NASA Coliseum. Another seven years, and it was Madison Square Garden and Continental Airlines Arena, plus the Javits Center for Overflow. Each CM Hashas inspired thousands all over the world to start learning the Daf. And here we are tonight the largest Siam Hashas in history, where a great American palace of sport has been transformed 
into a sanctuary of the spirit. Tonight, in the presence of close to a hundred thousand people, we celebrate with pride and delight our nation's greatest achievement, the everlasting commitment to Liman HaTayra for each and every Jew. Tonight, we send a message to Achenu B'nai Yisrael that no matter where you are, no matter what you do, we are all united, Ke'ish Echod, Belev Echod, by the sacred words of the Holy Daf. May that message resonate around the world and hasten the arrival of Mashiach Tzidkenu, B'mheira, the Amenu. Amen. We are requesting everyone's cooperation to respect Kavada Torah and the dignity of tonight's program and to refrain from walking through the aisles during the program. Thank you. It is with great pride that we call upon Horav David Alevsky, Rosh Yeshiva Mesifta, Beis Yisrael Degur, who will preface his remarks with divrei bracha that were sent from the Gera Rebbe Shlita via our good chaver of Shlomo Werdiger. The Lushen from Gera Rebbe to the Hante Gemamet shall say a bruche mit hatzluche. Teure is the greatest bruche. Medav zich mischazik zan en limit a teure. Kvi is item la teure, da fayoimi. The teure brengt de greste bruche in alle in unim. Amen. Quod, of a minske rebbe, gedeule teure vachsides. Teure heilige Eden. In a kotze pumenet, wet me kimmen zu dem Klimax von dem Hantigen Simches hat Teure. Wenn die ganze Eulen, die Eidak Deutsche, wenn mit gewaltigen Israkschen suchen, die lang gewalten vier Werte, Hadrin ein Loch, Talmud Bavli. Die größte Musa Have, in es Kaschris, wo zu der Have ist Kadimien nicht du, wird man der Herren, wenn die Jeden Wus proklamieren jeden Tug in jedem Minute zum Darf, sehr deudi, wie sehr reihei. Der Jid mit seinem Gemure, der Jid mit seinem Darf, wird mit Zimche herausschreien, Hadrin Allah, Talmud Bavli, wie steht in Uwes der Abnusen, eine Habe, keine Habe, so teure. Er mit Gegiem, mit Shashim. Wenn sich Klal Yisrael, der Knesis Yisrael zum Tamil Bavli, Kedabe Ischel Reyai, nicht Hadran al Talmud Bavli, nicht Daton al Talmud Bavli, noch Hadran al Loch, Daton al Loch, Leines Nashai Menach, Meretz im Talmud Bavli, der teurische Balpei ist Leben, jedes Wort lebt, jeder Mann, der umlebt, es bringt Leben. Allah, Hadran Allah, steht in ihre Schalmi. Kolleume, du willst mit die Omra. Jeder ist bei Schmier, Kolleume mit Kenegdoi. Bei jeder Soft mit Sechte, weil er verkörpert in sich. Leben in Lebedicke. Suche mir Hadran Allah, wir reden zu dir, der Talmud Babel ist steht für uns. Das Heiligste, was wir haben, ist von unseren Augen angewickelt. Dann nur in meiner Ruhe, in meiner Hand, bei Nacht, wenn wir endlich schaffen. Suche mir zu allen Tannuen, mit zu allen meiner Ruhe, mit der Heirasche, Teusse, was. Mir redet zu sein, ke illi bal schmier, oi mit kinnig deini, hadren al loch, tal mit babli. Ich hab gehört von Mattes, der verruhsach rein, alle Brüche. Als amula kure von Samsäufer, 
hat sich herangehabt bei einem Zimmer, wenn er gegreit am Schier. Hat er gehört, wie es am Säufer lernt. Wenn der Mattes der Ruhe zu mir verzeiht, hat er gezittert. Um er dabei, hat er dabei gesucht. 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 Er gebringt den Ball Schmier von der Ruhe. Mir sind nicht der Herrste mit drei. Aber bei vier Schuren, ich besitze zu dir, kein Bekehr, auf Gedeutschen, Bolschein, Chassidem, Geizzi, ich bin Kahalois, Riverweis, Amcho, Beißes, Ruhl, der Herrste mit drei. Wir kommen zu zu den Herrsten Menschen von Claudius, wo sie gewähnt. Wir können nicht den Mann nicht nehmen, aber mit Kahalois, Riverweis, ist du die größte Keuches. Für Moshe Rabbeini, das muss sein, der teure Akdeutsch. Und er bringt daraus die Ahabe von Rabbeinisch Leulam zum Kneisis des Lohm. Hashem ist Sinai Bu, wir suchen Messiah Lumoi, bei vier Mahar Puran, wir usum Rivers Koidisch, mir Minoi, Eich das Lumoi, auf Choivaiv Amim kol Kedeusche wie Jedechu, wir haben Tikiler Aglechu, Jesu mit der Brasechu, teure Zeveluni Moshe, Merusho Kehlus Yankif. Rasche Mazba, der Beine Schleun, wie ich immer mehr Puran, wie ich immer Messiah, wie ich immer so wie Chusna Joizel auf Naya Kalle, wo Use bei Riverweis Koidisch, sagt Rasche, mein Riverweis Koidisch. Er war es nicht alt, er hat gewissen, ach heilig, für den Riverweis Malache Koidisch. Du bist die Trasche. Auf Chauwei v'amim, sagt die Rasche nach der Wache, auf Beschaß gebussen, schelo emes, sche reise lehen punem seuche kois, der Beinisch leulem Wasser freilich punem im Sato, es ist ruhl bei Judam, es kol ke deuschow bei jedeichu, kol zadikayem v'tivayem, dof ki bechu, velo imushi machereichu, Vaheim tiki il raglechu, haim es matzim, im es kansim tachas zilach, mi kabeling zayr es seichu, wad es seichu besimchu, vaheile de vrayim. Teurer ashe zivil uni moishe merushe kilis yankev, achaz niyo, veloi naz venu. Moira verabai se. Hamba nacht, kim klal yisru, zum Beurig alle Lumen. Och, mein Rüber ist Kaidisch. Zehner Tausende jeden. Nicht kann man luchen. Menschen. Kriegt sein Chäume. Mit allen Giften, die es dich nicht stark ist, alle Tages, eulem Hase, was er du herangebacken in einem Mensch. Ja, eure Beunische Leute, um der Zipper ist nur ein Heilig, mein Rüber ist Kaidisch. Sind nicht alt. Du noch rüber wirst heilige Jeden, wo Ure zu Bagäule, will ich eine Rasse für sich sticke, zu lernen jeden Tag dem Dorf gemure. Sie ist es meine Simche zu Cholile verkehrt. Alles so zarten, du lässt jeden, in einer Matze von Choiva auf Amen. Alle Tug schreien die Jeden, Bahave Rabbe, sei Deudi, wir sei Raiai. Ach, als Nio, wir leuen als Venu, mir geht es nicht ablösen. Leuen als Venu, kann ein Tug, kann ein Mesechte, kann ein Sigi, kann ein Dörf, von da ein Teure, wenn er mir nicht ablösen. Das ist unsere Gullesjeden, mit der Chäufe Wärme, in welcher Schreien heraus. Ach, als Nio, wir leuen als Venu, gar nicht geheilig von der Teure. In Grach, noch einmal, wieder einmal, hat er einen Loch Tal mit Bavli. Wir beten bei der Schanes. Zrie bei Machiseo, bei Machiseo. Von deswegen, Chavike, Dwike, Boch. Ich habe es eine Lusche, eine Rasche. Ach, als Nio, seid ihr eine Lusche, Juchet. Wenn ihr euch nach Svenna, ist eine Lusche, Rabben. Im Pustig steht, ach, als Tiff, wenn ihr euch ein bisschen schublosen. Wir können sagen, 
Steiter vom Platz und Balatieren. Die Beine sind leulen. Emes! Wie Jankiv ist Stamm Joische für Hulam. Jankiv lernt daheim. Jankiv lernt bei Sachen bis Medrisch. Ma toi wie ihr leuche Jankiv. Emes! Aber Emes sei ein teurer Miskajemes. Der einzigste Kiem auf teure ist, geschem es as von Kehilles Jankiv. Hab an Nacht, du de Kehilles Jankiv es macht, ach as Niltake. Aber wir leuchen als Wenne beluschen Rabem. Jede Juchet habt sich zieh. Sie du hast sach jeden, was haben sich. Immer weiß man, macht Kabul ist. Aber die Keuch von der Sack, Kindes von der Sack, Kehilles Jankiv ist, aber der Chasniel soll hum makim. Es ist allein nicht möglich. Wir sagen, Daten an Loch, Talmud Babli. Daten an Loch, nicht mehr haben dich in Sinnen. Nein. Daten an Loch, in der ganzen Das ist auf dir. Adaf Yoimiit, Will ich gelernt, jede Dame Toimet, ich wohne in der Gegend. Wissen nicht, du, ergibt das für euch nicht hier. Daten an Loch, wenn ich geht, nehmen an dir. Daten an Loch, wenn ich Futter für Vacation. Es ist kein auf der Platz, wissen nicht, du, ergibt das für euch nicht hier, ergibt das für euch nicht hier. Daten an Loch noch mehr, es kommt das Schiedrich zu dir mit dem Kind, will er wissen, zu den Eltern sind, und das für euch nicht hier. Ein neuer Begriff in jüdischen Leben. Du siehst die gewaltige Aufteilung, was man sehen will, ein Hohr in sie blüht, in sie blüht, in sie geht stark, und dann noch tiefer. Da hat ein Loch, man macht ein Geschäft mit dem Talmudar. In sie das geht man dir, in sie will nicht schon eigene das, aber da doch, allein, geben sie das teure. In sie leben ist viel mit den Sionis, in the Leben is filled with high challenges. That on a loch, see skim the anting in the sion as we say do, technology, chinech, panusis, mitzachen, kesaida. Gibbons that's toyrem is en zich mevatl in ganzen, that on a loch, ve da toch alon. Loine snashe menoch, oi matu gesein, Ma tich doch geleibt et kiefe, was de sonne mam gesucht lechi, men ak chida me goi, velo yezuch e shayim yisru al oid. Vizichom lo yusuf me zarom shtayt in yerushalmi me kaan, she kove loi chachume me sechte. Sin ishtu ka ander es chizkiyem faklal yisru al. No aloch tal me bab li lunis nashay. Mi vel nish fagesum ven, is no me noch tal me bab li. Mit dem Schiss von dem Limit der Teure. Aber der Boy sei, der Herz kommt mit der Teure. Wir haben jetzt gelernt, dass wir so viel Sicht und so viel Schaß an die Anzahl Alexander haben gefragt, die Wrei der Herz von der Pschie von Hanania, aber ja, so gut und wie ich kann, das hat der Herz schade. Bis jetzt sie gesucht, ist Paul und mich, ich wacke 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 mich, את הזויך הזה אני צריך לחוכמה. זה לא כאן דחרץ נשת. אני מבין לי שוויסן עם רבי נשת לא יהיה למשך חוכמה. זה לא דחרץ, וזה קודם לא תוירא. אין איש יספלל! ניש דוונן, נו יבקש רחמים! תומי איז בדי דה תוירא נורא פלוס! אין דה סיניש דן לב מנון דה עם פילסטה רחמונס! או סיניש גבית נפה תוירא אין דה סטחה זוי פושט! Wie mit Davon in jedem Tag, wo Vini, ja, kennst du das schon, ist bis Tatate. O wo Rachman bis Tatate mit Rachman ist. Racha im Alleini. O wo Rachman ist in Gebens der Havun in Teure. Weil unter der Tfille ist es bechlau nicht gebeten auf Teure. O wie der Rambam sucht der Chaie, weil er hoch mir beliebt Teure. Ist kein Leben nicht. Aber mit Davon da soll, hat man endigen. Schass. Am Davant jeden Tag, Rachaim allein ist, aber Rachmun ist auf uns, hat man endigen Schass. Und ich steht in Chazal, am Meilich steht in Jabeloi, er tut nicht mehr bei seinen Nuschen. Und wenn am Meilich will mehr bei seinen Steit in Chazal, all sie jetzt schon bei Jabe, 
Man will nicht mehr Wattel sein. So ist der Bein nicht schleulen. Verschimm Sache, die ich nicht mehr Wattel sein. Ich dachte, mit der Teufel mir rüber. Wenn jeden sind nicht mehr Kabel, man will mit keinem sein, man will endigen. Ich dachte, die Äußere ist eine Teufel, die ist eine Schiene, weil ich die Sprache gehe darauf. Und sie beten sich los, dem jeden endigen, wie rasch es ist. Nein, für Schummel, um die Leute, Jude, Mummel, wo man sich teure Mäle, wo man sich machen, teure Marseille, im Vakations, meist keine. Ach, als Nio, wir leuen als Venu. Sind nicht kachillig wie, sind nicht kachillig wenn, mit jeder Mäle, mit Geitens nicht uplosen, kotz gut getatscht, als Chaim, Hiele, mach sich im Bo. Meint, wenn ein Mensch fühlt sich wie ein Halsechun in einem Strick, über ein größer Grieb, in der Weißdom und Halila wird es uplosen, ist er fertig. Ach, als nie, wir leuen als Venu. Du sie rachmen, ins Weißen, sehr teuer, heilig Wort. Für mehrere Schieber, Reb Chaim Schmulewitsch. Reb Kiewe kommt daheim nach zwölf Jahren. In der Hälfte, wenn er bei ihr sucht, wollte er mich gefolgt. Wollte er gegangen auf noch zwölf Jahre. In der Geit nicht daran, er stieb. Hat Reb Chaim gesucht, das gewaltige Wort. Weil zweimal zwölf, in ist einmal 24. Das ist ein gewaltiges Wort, für Keuling gelacht. Für ins Balbatten, Lomme Matthias an etwas anderes. Wir haben eine Schie in der Früh, wir haben eine Schie bei der Nacht. Zwölf Schuhe sind wir weg von den Gemüren. Da wir kommen in mitten Tag, machen eine Pumme nicht, ob zu Chasen und ob zu lernen, eine Mischne, eine Mischne, eine Saluche, eine Mitzwe, eine Schofetzchei, eine Schie in Misse, eine Leime, eine Frise, eine Fülle mit dem Leibais. Ob man sich dem Tug zerbrochen hat, wo ich seit zwei Mal sechs weg von den Gemüren in nicht ein Mal zwölf. Ach, als Nio, wir leuen als wenn, um es sich uplosen auf ein ganzer Tug. Im Mitten Tug gibt man noch oben um den Connection. In Kolschken Dramo vier nicht ein Mal zwölf. Wie viel mehr Arbeit? Moi rei vera boi sai, se du apsar gusche, ins weißen, a de greste, zman, tfille, is ba psiche se uge, wem ef in de moor. Ich mein, a des de einzigste moor, was me beit tfille, se beluschen juchet, le hev a nu pegide, nisch a luschen rammele, keine, gedenk nisch, as ei mein. Meine hand, me ef in tof, a tal me bavli, Es ist eine Matze von Psychos. Wir können beten. Uno, bekoyach gedilles jemincho ist der Rusche Teiwes von jedem Gimmel auf. Tatezriel. Hilf jedem, was man darf. In jeder Engschaft. In dort, wie wir beten. Bereuf tivcho naheil adesheicho. Vierens, schaffe seine Kabeil. In my beten kabbal rinas amko rebeine shaloylam zay di simchif in di yidin. Rinas amko zay di tfilif in di yidin hand. In dem tuk is beroif tifchu nahail adaseichu mizugin da agude bekuroif nahail nitay chanu pediyim letziyim berinu pediyim amishrat mit zwei yidin is da oisi is daf yoymi mit biyis amishir mim haya bimayni umay. For the first time in history, over 16,000 Tinoke Shabbes Rabban participated in the Masmide Hasiyam program, learning over 1.5 million Mishnayas and more than 6 million lines of Gemara in memory of the Kadoshim who perished in the Holocaust of Khurban Europe. We now present an audiovisual tribute to them.
Tonight, we mark the enormous accomplishment by the Masmide Hasil, children of Klal Yisrael, who in their spare time learned Torah for the sake of one and a half million children who lost their lives al Kiddush Hashem in Churban Europa. Those who learned understood that those who perished never had the opportunities that we take for granted today. One and a half million Mishnayas, six million lines of Gemara were learned. As Rav Shimon Schwab Zatzal said at the ninth Siyam Hashas, the word Hadron comes from the word Hodar, beautiful and precious. Tinoikes is the name of the last Perik we are Messiah tonight. But the word can also be read as Tinoikos, children. And so tonight we read Hadron Aloch Tinoikos. Hadron Aloch Tinoikos. How precious are the children. How precious are the children who learn for the children whose lives were lost. Al Kiddush Hashem. I am one of the Masmidei Asiyam. Ich bin eins von den Masmidei Asiyam. I am one of the 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 Masmidei Asiyam. Please join us now as we pay tribute to the representatives of the 16,000 Masmide Hasiyam assembled on the dais, followed by a tefillah on behalf of all children, Bizakeni, sung by Rabbi Baruch Levine. We ask all children seated throughout the stadium who participate in the Masmide Hasiyam program to rise as we pay tribute to you. Oh, the left hand, I'm going to have a way right. 
approach the actual seum of Talmud Bavli, I would like to call upon Reb Gedalia Weinberger, chairman of the Dafyemi Commission of Agudis Yisrael of America, to introduce the seum, followed by the actual seum, which will be made by Rav Aryeh Malkiel Kutler Shlita, Roish HaYeshiva Beis Medrish Gavoya, and Chaver Moyetzes Gedoli Atayra. Bershus, Rashi Yeshiva, Admarim, Rabonim, Lamdei Daf Yomi, Achai Verei, Mazel Tov, Mazel Tov, Mazel Tov. Mazel Tov to the Lamdei Hadaf. You are the true Balei Simcha tonight. Mazel tov to the over 1,000 Magide Shia. You work tirelessly seven days a week to be Marbitz Tyra every day of the year. Mazel tov to the wives and children of the Loimle Hadaf. Who, through your support, are truly partners in this most glorious journey through Shas. Mazel tov to all who have joined us tonight in this incredible Simcha Satoira. We are now about to reach the capstone of the evening, the actual Siyam Ashas. We begin the Siyam with the words Hadran Allah the Hadra Chalon. Generally, this is taken to mean we shall return to you, Shas Bavli. Perhaps there's another meaning. The word Hadar means splendor, magnificence, and glory. Chazal in Mesechtes Derech Eretz Zuta tell us that Hadar Elikim B'nei Adam, Hadar B'nei Adam Taira. The glory of Hashem is man, and the glory of man is the study of Torah. As we finish each Mesechta, we declare Hadran Allah. We are glorifying the name of HaKadosh Baruch Hu in the learning that we have just completed. 
We also say Hadra Chalon. We ask that Hashem Yisbaruch glorify Klal Yisrael. How much more so tonight, when such a great Sivir is finishing all of Shas? We say to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, see how your children have come to add to your splendor. And we ask that Hashem Yisbaruch add to the splendor of Klal Yisrael. In a few minutes, we will be hearing the Hadrin from the Messiah, the Lakewood Rosh Yeshiva, Harav Agon Rav Aryeh Malkiel Kotl Shlita. He has been learning Daf Yomi for the past seven and a half years and is being Messiah Shas this evening. 52 years ago, on the 14th of El, Tav Shin Chof, September 6, 1960, at an Aguda convention, Rav Malkiel Zayda, Harav Agon Rav Aaron Kotl Zatzal, walked into a meeting of Gidele Harabonim and asked if anyone knew what a special day that was. No one did. Rev. Aaron informed them that it was the day of the Siyam of the fifth Machser of Daf Yaimi. He then proceeded to say the Hadron, for he had just completed Shas. Baruch Hashem, how far we have come. At each Machser, the ranks of Loimde Hadaf have grown exponentially from tens to hundreds to thousands to tens of thousands. Kain Yerbu. And as we are Messiah the 12th Machsa and begin the 13th, we will be Messiah. We will sing and we will dance. We will cherish the moment and create memories that will inspire us for the next seven and a half years. We cannot overestimate how precious such memories can be. There was a boy from Lublin who was quite young at the outbreak of World War II. After trials and tribulations, he miraculously survived Corbin Europe. Years later, when he was asked what gave him the strength to survive, he said that on one Simchas Torah, Rav Meir Shapiro Zatzal, the founder of Daf Yaimi and the Rav of Lublin, attended the Akafis at the Maharshal's shul. At one point, Rav Meir Shapiro picked the boy up and danced with him. The Hadras Ponim, the face of a true tzaddik, the joy of that Hakafa was burned into his memory. That memory sustained the young boy through all those horrible times. Tonight, let us dance with our children and grandchildren, with our Chavrusas and Chaveirim, and may this chus of our tefillis of our limit hatayra and simcha hatayra sustain us until the day when Mashiach Tzidkenu will come and lift us up in the Geula Shalema of Him. Heira of Yamenu. Amen. It is now our schus to ask the Lakewood Rosh Yeshiva Shlita to be Messiah Shas. It's on page 200 of your Hasim books. Amis <laughs> 
Amaimus von Simcha, von Nimmer der Teure, von Simcha, von Asium, von Schass, von Claudius Roll. Das ist aber Hibischur und Melech, Asakinus, Asakinus, von Quoi der Teure, von Quoi der Hashem ist Boach, Akinus von Behibischur und Melech, wo sagt er mir seinen der Arm, der Arm der Teure, was Jesch Melech bei Israel, was Mohammed der Melech, der Behibischur und Melech, der Rebbeinische Leulam. In der Parsche von der Art Art von Bechatonu, mit Kola Amin von Klaal Yisrael. Aschabach Abonu, mit Kola Amin, wenn das an Lono ist, Teir Rossoi. Steht in Posik. Wir hießen die Skula, mit Kola Amin. Vatem Tiu, die Mam Leches Koyen, in Vigoy Kodosh. Wir hießen die Skula, mit Kola Amin, Klaal Yisrael, ist der äußere Chovi von der Rebbeinische Leulam. Steht in Chazal. Mit dem, was Claudius soll, Pein auf Lernen teure, ist Claudius soll dem Äußer Chobi von der Rebbeinische Leulam. Claudius soll ist dem Amleches Koyan in Vigoy Kodesh. Claudius soll ist dem Name Lochim, der Bonnef Shal Mokim. Claudius soll ist der Goy Kodesh. Das ist der Friede von Claudius soll. Und auf dem steht ein Possig a Hagdome. Steht ein Possig, Atem Reisem Asherosisi le Mitzrayim. Wer es so es kann mal kämpfen in Schorim, wer auch wie es kann mal loi, it gesehen was ich getan habe mit Zrayim, in Mitzrayim, it gesehen, wer es so es kann mal kämpfen in Schorim, ich habe auch aufgehoben, nach kämpfen in Schorim, ich habe einfach gebrennt zu mir, das geht auf, ich ziehe es mit Zrayim, ich ziehe es mit Zrayim, und der Bönschlamm hat uns gebrennt zu ihm. Was meint es, wer auch wie es kann mal loi, steht in Targum, Kreivis ja schoin le pulchoni, der Ebisch tut uns mekarev gewähren auf dem Dinnen, auf euwe sein der Rebbeinische Leulam. Steht ein Tag um Jönesen, mit Hamon Kreivis ja schoin le Ufen der Reisoi, der Ebisch tut uns dann entert, und wir sollen lernen, mein Teure, lernen der Rebbeinische Leulam ist Teure. Das meint, wo auf ihr Eschem Eloi, und davon deswegen darf man doch verstehen, was ist der Wahrheit, wie Eschem Eloi? Er bringt uns zu ihm, er ist uns mit Karri, was war los in das Wahrheit, wie Eschem Eloi? Nur durch Sach steht am Anfang Paschus bei Midbar, bei der Mitzvah von den Minyan von Klal Yisrael. Steht zu, es roi ich kola das b'nei Yisrael, und ich bechoi sem lebe sa avoi som. Du bönsch dem es Moshe Rabbeinu, euch zählen dem Klal Yisrael. Jede jeden dem Klal Yisrael. Steht mit Ben Östrim schon, aber Marlo kol Yitzel Zobbe bi Yisrael. Von jeder eine, was über 20 Jahre, was es ein Yitzel Zobbe geht, der Reusen der Armee in Klau Yisrael. Em so mit Zählen. Frag der Klau Joko, mit Zählen doch zu wissen, wie groß ist der Klau Yisrael, was auf See ist, da hast du es erschienen. Was ist wichtig zu den Mannen, was ist ein Yitzel Zobbe, was meint das, dass sie rufen sich Yitzel Zobbe. Sagt der Klau Joko, das meint nicht, dass sie gehen in Reusen der Armee. Ja, jetzt ist so, wenn man meint, dass klar ist, so ruft sich, Zivo ist Hashem. Klar, bei jetzt einmal, ja, immer sehr, heut sich, ja, heut sich Hashem, ist Zivo ist Hashem, ja, zu kalt, Zivo ist Hashem, mehr als Mitzrayim. Ist klar, ist so, da rausgegangen von Mitzrayim. Klar, ist so, ruft sich, Zivo ist Hashem. Und bei ihm ist, und da sehen wir mal Lochim, seine zwei, ist Zivo ist Hashem, ist klar, ist so, ist euch Zivo ist Hashem. Und der Ramban sagt, das soll ich auf seinen Häufen, sagt der Ramban, das klar ist so, mit Asif, Yachid, ist klar, ist so, ruft sich als Zauber. Na, man darf das verstehen, mit was ist klar, ist so, als Zauber? Klar, ist so, seine Armee. Was meint das, dass klar, ist so, als Zauber? Was steht denn denn? Na, durch Sache der Pschat ist, so da gemorgen, der Gemorgen steht, Omer ab Joich, Omer ab Joich, na, mischem, ab Schimmen bei Jichoi. Steht, Lehoyo Odom, Shekore, la Korishboch, Odoin. Sie ist gewähnt, kein Mensch auf der Welt. Was hat gerufen, der Rabbein ist Leulam Odoin. Was meint Odoin? Steht in Teusvis, Odoin meint Melech Oilam. Es ist gewinnt kein Mensch in der Welt, was hat gerufen, der Rabbein ist Leulam Melech Oilam, Machabo Avram. Es hat aber Perle. Avram hat Wien und nicht gewinnt der erste Maimen. Es ist gewinnt der Sach Maminim. Odom, Scheiß, Mishuselach, Neuach, Shem, Beeva, Beoid. Was meint es, Odom und Richter, gewinnt der erste Maimen, der erste, was hat geglaubt, dass der Rabbein ist Leulam, ist der Melech Oilam. Was hat der Avrom Avinu Mechadisch gewinnen? Avrom Avinu Tessalein Makir gewinnen, aber mit was hat das Mechadisch gewinnen? Als er soll sein, der Erste, was er ruft in der Schem Odoin. Nur der Pschat ist, steht in Chazal, steht in Avrom Avinu Tessalein Makir gewinnen, Beiroi. Steht in Chazal am Moschel auf dem. 
Moshele Adam Shaya Oivel Mi Mokum Le Mokum. Ein Mensch ist darüber gegangen von einem Ort und zweiten. Und im Mitten gehen die den Weg, seht ihr ein Biro der Leckes, seht ihr ein Palaz, was leicht, ein Palaz, was lebt, hat er getracht, ist denn da, als ein Palaz, Scheich, als ein Palaz, ohne ein Bala Biro, ohne ein Mannig zu der Biro, ist der Moschel geht, als Hitze soll auf Bala Biro, hat er rausgesteckt seinen Kopf, der von der, ist der Bala Biro, und hat gesagt, an Nihu Bala Biro, kach, Avrom mit Metame gewinnen, Efschel Eulam bli Manig, Ich hitze es auf der Balabira, ich hitze es auf der Balabira, und der Ebi Stahl Reusger, der Ebi Stahl Reusger, der Ebi Stahl Reusger, der Ebi Stahl und gesagt, an Nihu Balabira, an Nihu Manniger Eulam, ich bin das der Manniger Eulam, Herr Wey, auf dem steht euch gefühlt, wer immer ist, aber warum lech 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 lech. Ist doch sagt der Moschel, steht der Amor, die Kasach, mit der, so da, am Medina, am größten Medina, so da, am Malchus, so da, am Medina, am Medina, was hat der Melech, am größten Medina, was hat der Melech, was ist das größte Land, Tausende, tausende Miles, tausende, tausende Kilometer. In der Bier, in der Malchus ist da ein Palaz, was dort und wo in der Melech. Was ist der Unterschied zwischen in der Palaz und in der Malchus? So da Städtlach, was ein Weit von der Bier ist am Malchus. Was ist eine Nemonim zu der Malchus? Sie, 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 Aber sie leben nicht gar nicht zu tun mit dem Melch. Sie leben in seinem eigenen Leben. Sie leben in seinem Leben von den eigenen Geschäften, von den eigenen Business, von den eigenen Mischbachen, von den eigenen Farms. Sie haben nicht kein Scheiches mit dem Melches. Zum Sof, ja, ihm geben sie ein paar Dollar, ein paar Taxes. Mit dem sind sie mit keinem, die Mitzvah haben Melch. In der Biere, wie groß, wie, wie groß die Biere soll nicht sein. Aber die Biere kann sein, tausend Teravodim, was er sagt von sich, wenn kein Mann nicht sende Melch. Aber auch wenn ich kein in der Palaz von der Melch existiert nur Malchus, keine hat ich keine eigenen Geschäften, keine alle wohnen in alle seinen Eifer der Mischol ist der Melch, alles ist zu der Malchus. Das ist aber immer wie nur Macke gewesen, als der Welt ist nicht der Medina von der Melch Eulam. Der Welt ist nicht der Medina von der Der Welt ist der Büro von der Melech Eulam. Wir können nicht mehr beschmieren, ich weiß nicht, was wir sagen, ich weiß nicht, was wir sagen. Der ganze Welt ist der Welt ist der Mokim von der Melech allein. Und alles, was man tut, ich finde, man geht zu anderen Sachen, ist das alles ein letachles Echo. Sie letachles auf Quoid Amalchis, sie letachles auf Quoid Amalchis, sie letachles auf Quoid Amalchis. Das hat Avraham Avinu Maki gewonnen, wenn er gesagt hat, er hat ein Ebestes Adon. Durch sich, er hat das Bescheid, als klar ist, er ruft sich zu Zivis Hashem. Klar ist, er dient der Rebbein Shleilam, nicht von der Weiten. Klar ist, er steckt nicht in der Stadt, sondern er dient der Rebbein Shleilam. Abdus Hashem mit dem Maschoris von der Melech. Abdus Hashem, wir lernen sein Teure, Lernt man auf der Schule von der Melech, wie steht in der Gemorre, ist auf Nieder, alle haben jetzt gelernt in der Gemorre, in der Gemorre steht, da man sitzt, da man lernt Teure, sitzt man auf der Schule von der Melech, und da eben steht, Teil Chalokim von Teure. Klar ist, so sitzt, befniem, ist in der Malchus, in der Bieders, in der Malchus. Klar ist, so in der Welt, in der Welt kann man nicht, in der Welt kann man nicht lernen Teure. In der Welt ist nicht kein Mord, aber auch kein Mocken für Teure. In der Welt ist nicht kein Mocken für Erweide. Die Welt von Chumni ist, die Welt von Gashmi ist, die Welt von Taivis, die Welt von Aspoi ist, die Welt, wo der Gas der Gas ist, von derselben Welt, ist nicht gemockt und verteure. Klar ist, soll er lernen, teure gehen sie rein, beteuert die Mechizis von der Rebbeinischen Leulam. So da ist ein Musik von der Eulam hat teure, ein Eulam hat teure lebt anders, ein Eulam hat teure lebt höher, als einer lernt teure, geht er rein, bei mir zu euch von der Rebbeinischen Leulam. Wir auch wie Eschem Eloi, die Rebbeinischen mit uns reingebracht, mit Pnimi ist ein Bier, in seinem Cheder Apnimi, und er hat uns gelernt, der Teure dort und kennen wir lernen, der Teure dort und kennen sein, kein Schem, hier den Chochma, mit Piv da so zwunen, dort und kennen wir neu wieder sein, kennen wir schon sein, der Melech. Und was meint es, mir geht da rein, der Zitzive ist Hashem, ich denke, ich denke, ich denke, yo, Kivin Shekibli Yisrael, Malchus Ha'elayim, und sie haben gesagt, Nase Venishma, ist ja du, Shishim Ribi, Malach Ha'shor, ist ein Koshi, wenn ich denke, sorry, und ich denke, 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 ich denke,
Kleines, so geht er rein, kriegt Amten, kriegt er weiter Heilig von der Zivilisation, von der Zwar Hashem. Ist dämmelt, trockt Kleines, so der Kessel von der Rebbeinischen Leulam. Dämmelt, kriegt mit der Xorim, ist Jodem, Malach Hashor, sie gegeben der Xorim. Jeder Jid, was lernt Teure, ist ein Heilig von der Malchischen Mayim. Jeder Jid, was ist David, wie ein ehrlicher Jid, ist ein Heilig von der Malchischen Mayim. In Goyen steht, als am Jid, was lernt Teure, hat er mit Chochem, heißt der Saar, heißt der Minister in der Malchus von der Rebbeinischen Leulam. A Yid was davent, wie man darf zu sein lernt, er ist ein Ewe, er ist ein Scholz, er ist ein Minister, ein Minister in der Malchische Mayim. Das ist, wo er wie Eschem Eloi, das meint, dass klar ist, so lebt in der Besunder Eulam. Klar ist, so lebt in der Welt von Teure. Klar ist, so lebt in der Welt von der Rebönischen Eulam. Das ist, der Eulam hat Teure. Was eben lernt, ist, dass er öffnet, ist, quäut am Malch, ist, er reich allein. Das ist, der Eulam hat Teure, was das Gebäude. Das ist, der Eulam hat Teure. Was der Gedeile ist so, wird der Seele sich jetzt an die Bekorische Lebroche und andere Jeden sind gekommen am Gebäude, ein ganzer Eulam hat Teure, ein Eulam von Yeshivas, was kann man nicht mehr besitzen und lernen. Ein Eulam von Balabatim, was eine Kreve, Item der Teure, was sie machen, sie ricken nach Chaim, der Teure, was der Höchstpunkt von seinem Tag ist, der Teure, was sie lernen. Sie leben ineinander, sie leben in der Bibel des Amalchus, sie sind an der Häuben der Jeden, sie haben sich Herrscher von der ganzen Welt, sie sind andere Sorte Menschen, sie sind Menschen, die tragen auf sich die Kessel am Amalchus. Und auf dem steht euch gibt es wie Jesus die Schule mit Kolla Amim. Wie Jesus die Schule mit Kolla Amim steht nach Ramban, als dass es der Eutze Chovi von der Rebbeinische Leulam, Leuim Serenu Biad Acher. In der ganzen Welt da ein Hanhogi von Sorim, von Malachim, von Malachim, so da am Sam Melech Poras, Sam Modai. Aber klar ist so, dass der Eutze Chovi von der Rebbeinische Leulam, klar ist so, dass bei der Rebbeinische Leulam allein, klar ist so, dass es gehiet, es muss gehiet von der Rebbeinische Leulam allein. Wer, wer kann das verstehen, als am Ziel ist, als klar ist, als er sehr echt und bin schief im Seib, im Alle Deuris, und klar ist, als mit Skyim, auf der Sache nehmen. Wie kann man das verstehen, als in der Zeit, als man herumgringelt, mit Millionen, erste Billionen, äh, äh, Sonnen, was jeder eine will vernichten, dem klar ist, so ein bisschen so, wie es scheint, bei der Rathebe zu haben, nach Kium, ein paar Soldaten mit ein paar äh, Gewehr, mit ein paar Mix können das gar nicht helfen. Aber das, kann, das kann ich raten, wenn das kann ich abhalten. Das ist der Kone der Zume, der Tiv ist dickes, der Kone, was klar ist, so gefindet sich in dem. Der klar ist, so gefindet sich in der Schmiede von der Rebbeinischen Leulam. Wir wissen, wir sind Kuhler, wir sind auch wie Israel, als ob nicht teure in Amerika und in Israel. Als ob da jeden was lernen, wenn er bei Baboyko bei Erev, als ob da jeden was lernen, dass er bei Yomi. Als ob da jeden was geben sie ihr Tag und machen sie ihr Höchstpunkt von ihr Tag, der Limen der Teure, was sie lernen. Das macht am Egen allein in der Schusse von der Rebbeinischen Leulam. Das ist, was hielt dem klar ist soll. Das ist, was schießt dem klar ist soll. Kein anderer Sache kenne ich, was schießt dem klar ist soll. Das ist ein anderer, der hat Hefe, was kann das sein? Wir sind in der Ligion von dem Melech. Wir sind in der Zivis Hashem. Was wir lernen, teure. Bin ich teure. Jeden, was lernen, darf ich jäumen. Das ist, wir gehen rein in der Schusse, ich habe gesprochen, wir leben nach Hechres, wir leben. Ein Leben von Teure, ein Leben von Jesus Gemein. Ich habe schon Schleimer, sagt, dass die Sium ist parallel zu der Simcha der Chassene. Und wir müssen verstehen, was es bedeutet, es ist parallel zu der Simcha der Chassene. Das interessante Ding ist, wenn wir die Sium machen, wir nicht alle sagen, dass wir finished, wir accomplished, wir finished Schass. Wir nur sagen, dass wir zurück zu Schass kommen werden. Why is it that we don't mention at all that we finish Shas? We're going to come back to Shas. We say, Hadun Olecho. What is the meaning of that? The meaning is we have to understand. B'derech Marshall. When you build a, a tremendous building, a skyscraper, in order to build that building, we have to have a tremendous foundation. When you build a building that's 110 stories high, you need a foundation that's maybe 20 stories deep or 10 stories deep. And when we finish that foundation, it's a tremendous cause for simcha, for celebration, because we finished the foundation. But it's not that we finished the world of, of the foundation, the world, an underground world. It's because we have a foundation to build on, to go on further. When we finish learning, a chasna is the same way. It's a foundation for all the future generations that are going to build, be built on this. When we learn Torah, when we finish the Masechta, it's only in comparison It's a tremendous accomplishment, but in comparison to the accomplishment of the second time Shas, of the Hadun Allah, it pales. The main accomplishment is the next time that we have a foundation that we can learn Shas, we can continue to learn Shas further. 
it's a Yisoy, then it's a foundation for the Oilam of Torah that we are building, that we are part of the Oilam of Torah, the Oilam of the Rebbein Shal Oilam. It's a Yisoy for what will be Zoycha and Oilam Haba. It's a Yisoy for the fact that we are the Oilam of Torah. And it's a Yisoy for the Asad Lavoy, which the Rebbein Shal will be Mafia Alenu, be Magalos, tremendous Saitis and Torah, or Molos, Leis Hashem Kimayim, the Yam Mechasim. The Rebbein Shal should help that we should be Zoycha to live in this world of the Rebbein Shal Oilam. To be zayicha to the shmir of the rebbeinu shalolim, and we should be zayicha to mekadel mekadel doyres for Torah. Our learning of shash should be a foundation for the future learning that we're going to, to learn, and for the future generations, and for the future klal yisrael. And we should be zayicha to the shmir of the rebbeinu shalolim. And lo yachadish alti and toy v'niska chulanu b'mehir v'niska chulanu b'mehir lo iray v'biyes gal tzedik b'mehir v'yameinu amen. The more the state, Amal Rab Shami Rab Abba, Ema be a moment to have his over, Belila to have it neither. Maybe but Efsha Banacht, Kenzizana Zova, Belila is in our neither. Amal Eolecha Makran, Nidosa, Samach Linidosa, Samach Linidosa, Amos Havi Belelia, the Kakoyle Zova. So we see Mezem from them as the Ria from Belila is Ari's Zova. So, <laughs> Lenisnashimin <laughs> She takes her rascal, saying the boiler mazev, take him on a little my boat. Hanina by popper, Romy by popper, Nachman by popper, Ahoy by popper, Abamori by popper, Rafrim by popper, Rochish by popper, Sukhe by popper, Adu by popper, Dogu by popper. Harav no Adin oil, Hainus, Divis Rosco Befino, with fierce Amcho basis soil. The Lee Kulono and Nachno with Seto Enu, with Seto Amcho basis soil, Kulono Yede Shemecho, the Lone de Seto Seho. Moivet Hakmeni Mispe Seho, Kiloilum Hili. He lived with some Hukeho, Leman Loy Avoish, Loilum Loy Eshka Piku Deho, Kivom Hi Sonny, Bo Hatoado Inoi, Lamden Hukeho, Omin, Omin, Omin Salovet. Moidem and Achnul for Neho, I didn't know Hainu will have a Senu. She Samto Hokenem Yeshwe Besamedish, Le Samto Hokenem Yeshwe Connis. She on a Mashkimim, the Hay Mashkimim, on a Mashkimim in Divitora. They must keep him with Vaughan Betalem. On our mail and the Hema mail. On our mail and the Kabam Sra, the Hema mail and the Inam Kabam Sra. On the Rotsim, the Hem Rotsim. On the Rotsim Lachayoil and Abo, the Hem Rotsim the Bear Shachas. Shinema, the Atta, Elohim, Tahidim the Bear Shachas. And Shedom and Mimimo, the Yachty Yemen, but he after Boch. He wrote some of the Fonech Wadi and Oil High. Kishem Shazatanish, Shazatanul Messiah, Sakhis Lidu with Tamad Babli. Can <laughs> As the Siyum is dedicated to the memory of Yaakov Meir Chaim, Ben Eliezer HaKoyen Schottenstein, we now honor his son, Jay Schottenstein, with the recital of the Siyum Kaddish. Will everyone please rise? Yes, Gadal, Vies Gadash, Shemei Rabah. 
the Almighty who was seen as Hadosa, the Hayom as Hayos, Saka, was on the Hayoma, but Nekar told Rishlamish Kalola, He Kleba Gavan, Makar Bahono, Nikra, Minara, Lavasavo, Bahono, Dishmayo, Lasre, Vamliku, Dusha, Brihu, Mahuse, Bikore, the Hayakonu, Vimehonu, Hayda called Base Israel. By God, love is my career and rule. Amen. Yehesh may Rabom of Varak, the Lamo may Omaya. Yes, Barak, beast the Bach, beast par, beast her mom. Beast I say, beast of Dar, beast of Lab, beast of La, Shemedu Kudusha, Barihu. The Elo, Min Cobra, Hosa, Vishra, so. Tushbech Hosa v'Nechem Hosa, Dam Yirah v'Yomah v'Yimru Amen. Al Yisroel v'Al Rabbanon v'Al Tamidei Hon v'Al Kol Tamidei Samidei Hon v'Al Komar Dor Kis v'Rai Sodi v'Asra Hadei Medi v'Chav v'Asar v'Asar Yehei Lohon v'Chon Shlomo Rabba Echina v'Chis No V'Rachamin v'Chaim Rechein v'Znei V'Rechei v'Rchanon Min Kodom v'Hon Yishmaya v'Yimru Amen. Yehei Shlomo Rabba Min Shamaya V'chayim Tovim Aleinu Ba'ko Yisrael M'ru Amen O'seh Shalom B'mramav Hu B'rachamav Yaseh Shalom Aleinu Ba'ko Yisrael V'mru Amen Mazel Tov
Ladies and gentlemen, please find your seats. Ladies and gentlemen, kindly find your seats. We'd like to begin. Everybody, please find your seats. We'd like to continue the program. Ladies and gentlemen, please find your seats. We'd like to continue the program. Please, we ask you to please find your seats. Thank you, kindly find your seats. As the program is running a little late, and the trains don't travel all night, if we can ask everybody to please take their seats so we can continue with the program. Please take your seat so we can continue with the program. Just, 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 it doesn't matter if you're 
introduction, but now he starts speaking. Oh, right. Yeah. It is with great anticipation I have the honor of introducing the renowned Rabbi Yisachar Fran Shlita, Rosh Yeshiva Sner Yisrael, to give over Divrei Chizuk. Again, please, Mayor Rabbi Yisai, please. Take your seats. Will everyone please clear the area in front of the stage and please find your seats. Please respect Kavad Atayra. Please clear the area in front of the stage. Rishus, Ronan, Rabbanan, Rabbeisai. The daf, it's become so common an expression that it is no longer the daf yomi, but merely the daf. It's become a proper noun. It's part of become of our daily manner of speaking. Expressions like, did you do the daf? Where is the daf holding? Are part of our lexicon. But according to Rav Meir Shapiro, it's so much more than a mere figure of speech. The Gemara in Yevomis relates how Rabban Gamliel once saw a ship sink with Rabbi Akiva aboard. He was sure that he had drowned. When Rabbi Akiva miraculously appeared before him, Rabban Gamliel asked him, how are you saved? Amali daf shel svina is li. The temple translation of that is that Rabbi Akiva was saved by holding on to a plank of the ship, a daf. But the word daf in the word daf Rav Meir Shapiro saw a clear metaphor. It's the daf that saves so many of us as from drowning as well. Maybe not in the turbulence of the sea, but the turbulence that sometimes is our lives. Put succinctly via the haunting posted nigan that we know, the haunting posted that we know from that haunting nigan, lulei say rasra shashuai azavariti beonyi. If not for your terror that was my delight, I would have been lost in my pain. And this is what Rav Meir Shapiro tried to convey. That it is Limud HaTayra Bichlal and the Dafyemi Bifrat that is our life preserver. It's the lifeline that we all need. And that's very expression, lifeline, someone wrote to me to describe his relationship with Dafyemi. Suffice it to say that this person had had a difficult life. He was a Yosem at an early age. He had very little money. He had several med medical issues and he did have an easy time socially. And here is what he wrote me after the last Siyah Mashas seven and a half years ago. I have been out of Yeshiva for two years and I have barely learned a word. I was not all that happy with myself. I would come home at night and stare at my 19-inch color companion. And I realized that this had to stop. So I tried Daf Yaimi. As I sat in Madison Square Garden last Tuesday night, 
I was on the ale tail end of a roller coaster ride. I had not had the greatest mazel socially, job wise, city wise, and the list goes on. But what I did have was a lifeline, a constant companion on the train at the doctor's office late at night, early in the morning, a trusted companion who would never let me down, even if everything else and everybody else would. All this companion asked for me is that I visit every day for an hour or so. So I can hear what he has to say. It's the same message that the Ger Rebbe once told at Sebrach a broken Jew who had recently lost his wife and was very, very lonely, and he cried to the Rebbe from the depths of his solitude. And the Rebbe told him, If a Jew has a Blat Gemara, he's never alone. Which one of us wouldn't want such a companion? Liman Atayra is so much more than just another mitzvah. It is life itself. Those words, ki heim chayenu v'yairach yameinu, are to be taken literally, which helps us explain the famous Gemar Nesech de Yuma, that Hillel Hazoken used to spend half of his daily wages to gain entry into the base medrash. And one day when he couldn't find work and had no money, he went up to the roof in the dead of winter and listened from the skylight. All of an islas ale al pi aruba kidei sheyishma divre elokim chayim vipi shmaev av taliyin. The Chafetz Chaim asks, that this Gemara seems to contradict the well-known halacha that one should not spend more than 20% of his assets in the performance of a mitzvah. Why then did Hillel seemingly violate this halacha by spending 50% of his meager wages in the performance of a mitzvah? I once heard in the Chafetz Chaim himself in the Likute Halachas alludes to this. And that is because the Gemara uses an expression that the Gemara rarely used. Matter of fact, it's the only time in all of Shas Pavli that the Gemara uses this expression to describe a shir. And that is, Kidei Sheyishma, Divre Eloikim Chaim, Mipishmaev Avtalyon. This wasn't just a shir. This wasn't just another mitzvah to Hillel. This was Divrei Elohim Chaim. This was life itself. And for life itself, there are no spending limits. To Hillel, this was his lifeline. And when he couldn't afford it, he listened from the skylight. Hillel truly believed in those words, Ki heim chayeinu v'erechameinu. And on some level, we all feel like this, perhaps not consciously, but somewhere in the recesses of our souls, we know this to be true. Rabbi Aaron Paperin was a chaplain during World War II, and after the war was over, he would visit DP camps to provide for the needs of the Holocaust survivors, and we'd ask each of the survivors, Vas daftir? What do you need? And the answer would invariably come back, Ich daf aporshich. I need a pair of shoes. I need a pair of pants. However, there was one Yid. His name was Mr. Seeger. He was above of her chassid. He had a strange request. When Rabbi Paperman asked him, what do you need? His response was, I Rabbi Paperman said to him, Yo, yo, Abra Vaz Daftir, what do you really need? And again, the same response, Ich Daf Abba Kameh. Until Rabbi Paperman finally realized that that is what he really wanted, and he was successful in getting him a Gemar Bava Kameh. That Yid knew 
with his entire being that besides for clothes and shelter and food and water, every Yid needs something else. He needs above a kame. Ki heim chayeinu v'yarech yameinu. And there's another factor that motivates people to learn the Daf Yemi, even in our day and age. When Romer Shapiro started this magnificent program, it had a natural attraction. A Jew in Europe who toiled at a menial job during the day saw learning at night as an escape from a difficult reality. This was his hour of enjoyment. This was his relaxation, a respite from a life that was full of privation. But today, there are so many distractions, so much to occupy one's time, so much out there that dazzles the eye and the imagination. And yet, people will rise at 5 a.m. or begin at 11 p.m. To do what? To study a text written more than 1,500 years ago in a difficult language which is intellectually challenging with many arcane subjects. And this has to compete with other pursuits that seem so much more alluring. They will do this in planes and on trains and in buses. They will do this during chasinus waiting for the chuppah. They will do this in doctor offices and in supermarket checkout lives. They and their wives and their family And their children will bend their schedules to make this happen. Why? How do we explain the inexplicable? Perhaps it's because people realize that Tyra is real and everything else, no matter how dazzling, is just fake. The Pasik describes Matan Terah as the Rebbein Islam speaking to Klau Yisrael, Kayol Gadol Velo Yasof, a mighty voice, Velo Yasof. Rashi says that the words Velo Yasof means that the voice never stopped. But where is that voice? Have you heard it? My good friend Rabbi Yaakov Luban told me that he heard from his Rebbe. Rebellious Svei, who heard from his Rebbe, Rebaran Kotler, that that voice is the voice of the Rebbeinah Shalom talking to the to man through the Tyra. And when one and a Yid learns Tyra, he still hears the reverberation of the Rebbeinah Shalom speaking to man. That is the power of Limud Tyra. That is how the Daf competes and the Daf trumps. Because it is the real thing, and everything else is just fake. It is the power of the authenticity of Tyra. And we're hearing another voice today. The Medris says on Rabbi Shum ben Levi, Bechol yoyim v'yoyim baskal yitzas mehar chayrev, v'yimera soylehem lebriyais melbeine shal Tyra, that every day a heavenly voice bemoans the fact that ye did not learning enough. Well, have you ever heard that Pascal? If you're like most people, you will answer, no, I haven't. But in truth, we've all heard that Pascal, albeit faintly. The Baal Shem Tov was said that that Pascal is the Hirhure Tshuva, the thoughts of Tshuva that we have from time to time when we think I really should be learning more or I'm really wasting my time with this, that is that bus coil. But sometimes it's too fleeting. 
it's too faint. And we squelch it. And we quash it. And we ignore it. But today, sitting here among 90,000 people, We do hear that bus coil. It's the clarion call that emanates from this stadium that shouts, learn more. We can't say we don't hear it. We hear it loud and clear. And today we cannot squelch it. Today we must respond. And today, we must leave here with a plan. If you've never learned the Daf Yaimi, then tomorrow is the day to start. If this is your second or third time finishing Shas, then you ask yourself, must ask yourself, how am I going to do better next time around? Maybe go to a Shir Iyun once a week on the sugi of the daf. Maybe learn the daf in the morning and go to Shir Hazar at night. Maybe be so bold as to take tests on the daf. And if you can't learn then a daf a day, then make it an omid a day or a daf of Mishnah Brewer a day, or a Mishnah a day, but something a day. <laughs> but we must respond to that basco that we can no longer ignore and leave here with a plan. And that was the message that Rav Nosen Svi shared with a Yid name Rab Nachem Stillerman. Mr. Stillerman, after retiring, moved to Eretz Yisrael in honor of his 70th birthday. He finished Mesech de Shabbos, an accomplishment he proudly shared with Rav Nassim Tzvi Finkel. Rav Nassim Tzvi congratulated him, but told him that that's not enough. Go back and figure out a plan how you could finish Shas. He came back with a printout and figured out that by learning 10 hours a day, it would take him 23 years to finish Shas. Rav Nassim Tzvi's react, reactions was, now that's a plan. <laughs> Mr. Silliman, however, had a different reaction. I'll be 93 by the time I finish. How can I undertake a plan that I cannot possibly finish? Rav Nossin Svi Finkel, by then afflicted with debilitating Parkinson's disease for more than 28 years, struggled mightily from his seat. And while shaking, he reached under the tablecloth and pulled out more of his plans for the expansion of the Mir Yeshiva. And he turned to Mr. Stillerman and he asked him, and do you think I can do what I'm doing? Look at me! <laughs> but he had a plan. And that's what he demanded from Mr. Stillerman, a plan. And that's what's demanded from us today, a plan. And if it sometimes be, be seems beyond our kaiches, all we have to do is picture in our mind's eye Rav Nassim Svi Finkel. Mr. Stillerman once had another conversation with Rav Nossin Svi. Years earlier, Rav Nossin Svi had commented to Mr. Stillerman incredulously that maybe his Parkinson's disease was an einish, a punishment for not learning Torah Lishma. 
Mr. Silliman sometimes, sometime later offered a different approach as to why the Rashiva had to suffer based on the Yerushalmi Mesech to Hurias. The Yerushalmi says in Mesech to Hurias that when Meshur Abenu learned Torah on Har Sinai from the Rebbeinah Shalolam, he would forget immediately what he learned until to the end the Rebbeinah Shalolam had to give him the entire Torah as a gift. But why did Meshur have to suffer and endure this frustrating experience of a learning and forgetting and learning and forgetting and learning and forgetting? Says the Yushalmi, Kol kach loma, lahachsiris hatipshim, so that people who forget their learning won't give up and say, what's the use? It's an exercise in futility, I forget anyway. Meisha Rabbeinu provides the counter-argument. Mr. Silliman suggested that maybe the Rashiva had to suffer from his illness to provide living proof that one can learn even if it's difficult. Like the, like the man I heard about two nights ago, who was a member of Adaf Yemi in Brooklyn, but in the middle of the cycle became blind. But he would go to the Daf every day in spite of his blindness. He was the first to come and the last to leave to learn real Taira Sheba Al Peh. Rav Nosson Svi leaned over and kissed Mr. Stilliman and quoting the Gemara in Mesech de Makis, he told him, Akiva Nicham Tanu, Akiva Nicham Tanu, you have comforted me. In our generation, we had a Rav Nosson Svi Finkel, an American-born boy, raised in Chicago, Illinois, a graduate of every Crown Day School who became a Godelby Israel. Most of us will never become a Rav Nosensi Finkel. But he taught us all something. Even if we never stepped ear in the Mir Yeshiva. He taught us never to give up. He taught us not to say, this is too hard. He taught us to always have a plan. He taught us to aim higher. He taught us to reach beyond. And he taught us that beyond your reach is really within your grasp. It is my covet to introduce one of the Zikne Hadoyer, Harav Agoyen or Bitzak Shain or Shlita, the Rosh Hashiva of Kamenitz Yerushalayim, Chavar Moyetzis Kedoyle Atoyer in Eretz Yisrael, who flew to America last night to join us here after participating in the Siyam Ashas in Yerushalayim. The Rosh Hashiva will deliver Divra Yisairis while also offering Divrei Askara for Moran Harav Yosef Shalom the Ash of Zechet Tzadavi Kodesh Levrocha, whose recent tira is still raw in our hearts.
Before I say a few words, I want to read a message which was given to me to be a shaliach mitzvah during the long trip across the Atlantic Ocean to come to this theum by Moron Rav Arnleib Steinman Schlitter. whom I had the 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 here to sit near during the big Siam Hashas a few hours ago, not nearly as big as this one, but by uh, Israeli standards it was quite big in Yerushalayim Irakis. I read Mila by Mila, word by word. Besiato de Shmaya. Lechvoid River Voice. Bnei Yisrael. In honor of the tens of thousands of Bnei Yisrael, Hamiskansim, the Arthur Abris, Al Yudei Agudas Yisrael, the America, the Smoyach, the Simcha Satoira, in Siyum, Limud Shisha Hazdorim, Mi Talmud Bavli, Asherim Chilu, Rabbeinu HaKodesh, Veravino Veravashi, Asher Bom, Neilech Leoirom, Kol Yemei Chayei Klal Yisroel, Lo Netzach. Hashem Aleichem Yichyu Omar Hakosuf Lulei Brisi Yoimom Valoilo Chukois Shomayim Vooretz Loisamti Vze Rak al Yedei Loimde Hatoiro Sheheim Mekaime Hoilom 
בכל מוקים ומוקים. והנה, בשמחו רבו, אנו זוכים לשמוע כי דבר השם יזבורך מזרבה בכל תפוצות ישראל ושם שמיים נסקדש על ידי זה ויהי רצון שיזרבו לומדי תוירו והוגהו ומקיימהו ברצונו יסבורך שמוי ונזכה במהרו לאומו לו האורד דיו את השם יסבורך שמוי כמים ליום מכסים ובביאס גויל צדק במהרו ויומנו אמן. I have his signature in his own handwriting. The rest of it was typed. Aaron Yud period, which means Yehuda, Leib Steinman. Yud Beis of Tov Shin Ein Beis Lepak. Now, that the time has come for me to say a few words of my own. Actually, I prepared a speech. And papers all, o- all over my pockets. However, after taking part in this holy theum and hearing the marvelous speakers I don't mean marvelous orators. I mean speakers who, who poured divrei elokim chayim from their pure hearts. I stand before this tremendous audience of Mnei Torah, Oyhavei Torah, in awe and trepidation. I've forgotten my entire speech. And really it's not important. I don't want to spoil the wonderful words of Torah and encouragement that has been filling our minds and hearts these past few hours. However, Rabbi Friend, I believe this is the first time I've ever heard him speak or anybody like him. (laughs) 
he mentioned we have to come up with a plan. I want to humbly propose a little plan. But part of my obligation I can't forego. I had to speak a little bit about my Rebbe, our Rebbe, the Rebbe of Klau Yisrael, Hagoyen Rabbi Yosef Sholem El Yashiv, Zecher Tzadik V'Kodesh Livrocha. I must say just a few words. His loss, at the same time that all of these marvelous siyumim are taking place all over the world, strikes fear and trepidation into the hearts of every one of us. We have lost the true Godel Hadoyer, the Paisik Hadoyer, but he was the, the teacher of the Doyer and my personal teacher for, for 65 years in, in Eretz Yisrael. He was the Godel Doyer in many, many ways. In Yediyah Satoyre. In Yediyah Satoyre. In Midas Toivos, his goodness of heart was indescribable. In Chesed, his endless patience. I, an American youngster, not so young, but comparatively a youngster when I came to Israel 65 years ago. 90 minus 65 is not such a youngster. He had for me endless patience. An American has, has nerves. Again, I ask again and again. I once asked him, Wie viel darf man, wie viel mal darf man fragen? I was still nervous. So he good humored, humoredly answered me, me He encouraged me to keep coming and, and asking. Rabbi Friend said we have to come up with a plan. I have a plan. I want to humbly propose a plan. The Beit HaMikdash, we're a few days after Tisha B'Av. Chazal teach us that the Churban, the first Churban came al Ozvam. As the Navi Yirmiya teaches us in the Aftayr which we, we laned on Tishabov. The Ran in the Dorim explains the Pasukin in Yirmiya as follows. Yidn did learn Torah. They learned a lot of Torah. So why does the Novi 
accused them of al ozvam es toirasi. They did not abandon Torah. So the Ran says they learned, but without fervor. If they need gigangen in Leben as Horav Olevsky so eloquently put it, and what Gazen as Emma's Gatus in Leben. We all, my first proposal is as follows. Everyone present in this theum, in all the theum, should Beli Nether, resolve Beli Nether. Don't forget to say Beli Nether. To learn a daf a day together with all Klal Yisrael. That will be the Daf Asmina for us, which will keep us afloat. But that should not be the ultimate aim. Our true aim is to become, we're not going to become like Rav Yashif. We're not going to, you know how many Dafim he learned a day? He never divulged to anybody. His son-in-law, Reb Chaim, learns seven, eight, learns eight blot a day. Besides learning, kol kula every year. Kol kula. Bavli, Yerushalmi, Medrash, Zoyar, Tanakh. And he learned far more. How much, we don't know. Now, I don't propose that any of us aim to learn as much as Rav Yashiv learned, or even as much as Rav Chaim, Ibad al Aruchim learns. But we can strive to be somewhere in the middle, somewhat better than we were until now. If we really learn to love Torah of Anemis truly, sincerely, if the Oitzitun's gain in Leben, if, we, if our lives will depend upon it. The Baruch Ber, my Zayda, used to say the same word that, that Rabbi Friend so eloquently put, Taira is our life. If we will fear that feel that Torah is our life, <laughs> it's not easy to close the Gemara. We'll have a problem before we can close the Gemara. You like to learn, but if it's, it's just as easy to, to close the Gemara as to open it, there's a big question about how much you really love the Torah. So that's my first Proposal that everybody present should resolve Beli Neder to learn the Dafa Yoimi together with Claudius Yisrael and to strive to attain true love for Torah. As Olam's gain in Leben, we should feel that our lives depend upon it. But I have a second equally important proposal. Chazal teach us that the second Beis HaMikdash was Chorev because of Sinas Chinom and Loshon Hora. And Chazal teach us that Kol Doer Shaloy Nivna Besa Migdosh Bismanoi Ki Ilu Necherav Bismanoi. Because if we 
the present doer were to correct the faults of our Vedas, which caused the Churban, Hashem would send the Beis Amikdash with Mashiach immediately. If he does not send Mashiach so quickly, as we see it's taking much longer than we had hoped and expected and prayed, it's because we still adhere to the not so good ways of our ancestors which caused the Churm. My second proposal is that in addition to the time that it takes to learn the daf together with Klal Yisrael, we should also join Klal Yisrael in learning the Shi'ur Yoimi of Chofetz Chaim in Shmiras Haloshan. This should take a few minutes. And with that, we were just made a theum together with my good friend Agoyen Reb Malkiel. The end of the Masechet Nida we learned, Kol Hashoyne Halochos Bechol Yoim Muftach Loishu Ben Oilam Abo. Who doesn't want to be a Ben Oilam Abo? Now, if we learn the few Halochos every day. Takes a few minutes. In Chofetz Chaim, we are Mekayim, the son of the Bay Eliyahu. We will be Zeicha to Eirem Abo. And besides which, if we observe what we learn in those few moments, we will learn to keep our mouths closed, to keep our tongue inside, not to speak a word against any Jew, not a word bad about any Jew, and kol shekain about a Talmud Chochem or a Godel B'Tayra B'Yira. And if we observe these two resolutions, we will learn the daf together with Klal Yisrael and strive to attain true Ahavas Torah, a burning love for Torah. It shouldn't be easy to close the Gemara. We should strive for excellence in learning, to become big Talmud Echachomim, not just to, to go over the daf. Yoitze given. And if we will learn these few halachas in, in Shmiras Haloshin, the Chavetz Chaim will pray for us. We will guard our mouths and have pure mouths and pure souls. And Mashiach Sidkenu will come. Vimheiro v'yomenu. Amen. Before proceeding with the program, please pay attention to the following important announcement. NJ Transit officials, who have been tremendously cooperative in helping bring over 10,000 individuals here tonight, have advised us that due to scheduling limitations, anyone who arrived via the Secaucus Junction must begin to board the trains back to Secaucus by 11.30 p.m or risk missing, missing connecting trains at Secaucus. As we are concerned about the safety of everyone here tonight, please plan to depart by 11.30 towards the NJ Transit train station here at MetLife. We also wish to acknowledge the presence here tonight of more than 5,000 Bali Chuva and potential Bali Chuva.
and we recognize the efforts of Partners in Torah and the many other Kirov organizations for their extraordinary efforts in making this happen. At this time, we draw your attention to the jumbotrons throughout the stadium as we present an audiovisual tribute to the heroes of the DAF, the Magide Shir, the Lomde Daf Yomi, and their families. If there are two people that are come in front of us and they're holding a garment, and this one says, I found it. We normally take a dim view of it, but if it's the Zeruze Nafshe, he's doing it to encourage himself, to inspire himself. <laughs> Well, the Shani Lei says, so why do we, he tries another answer? Again, the Gemara does not... And I've been crossing off every single day. And at the beginning it was daunting, but now I'm on the last page. You know, you see the, the accomplishment of what we all have been able to do uh, just with one blot a day. It really is, you know, just one blot a day. So the mission begins, Avas Malachos, the main categories of Malachos are Boim Chazor Achas, are 40 months. Daf Yomi doesn't sleep. The Daf doesn't care whether you had a bad day. The Daf doesn't care whether or not you got up on the wrong side of the bed. The biggest Musha I can give a child, and I can talk to them from here until tomorrow, but when they see you every day, without an exception, there isn't a better Musha than, than, than that. And everybody knows where is daddy is at the Daf Yomi. The mayor says, open for Chomit, an Arab Pesach for the first five hours, an Arab Pesach you're allowed to eat Chomits. You start from its killer shake, and at the end of sixth hour is when you have to burn the Chomits. That's when you're... Whenever people tell me they don't have time to learn, I ask them, do you have time to brush your teeth? And what that really means is, you make time for things that are important for you. It's very simple. I plan my day around the Daf Yomi. If you read the Megillah by heart, Kro Targum, or if you read the translation of the Megillah, the Cholosh in any language. No matter how busy I might be in the office, I could stay there all night. I've got to be here at that particular time for this year. Everybody who attends a Daf is not only coming to learn, but they're inspiring others. They're inspiring their family and their friends. You feel like it's something that you need to complete, something that you want to complete, something that you want to do. The fact that I was able to finish the whole Shas uh, a few years after I, I became a Balchuga, it's a huge achievement for me. There are four primary types the Vichlanish comes to see this nefesh. So it's a geschmack. The magadshir is a geschmack. The olim is a geschmack. This is the mesidus nefesh is for the shpib and for the rabbe. This is also not a vegain. And so I have no lines like in kinder shlufen. If I insist, how do I turn a grachni? It's the zayis is a richtig mesidus nefesh. I owe any hatzlacha I've had in learning to my wife, and I'm sure that goes for everyone else out there also. We owe it to the encouragement and the serious nefesh of our wives. If a person. The commitment to preparation and the consistency of our Magachir is simply astounding. Didn't miss a single morning. We got home from the wedding at 2 a.m. At 6 a.m. I was back there saying it. When they say Kovati Itim Latora, it means you learned at a specific time every day. And that specific time is Muktosh for learning. In any animal, and you find that it's a tray for animal, it's not did something wrong, it's not a kosher animal. When I was traveling and I was in a city that I had never been in before, just walked into a shul, sat down and Klal Yisrael was one. It's a great thing to be connected to Klal Yisrael. Everyone focused on that same page at the same time. That page is in the spotlight that day. Now I feel like I sort of gained a whole new family by spending the seven years with the same Hebrew learning together. 
Toises, the Rabbi Yosef and Rabbi Hanine, Rabbi Yosef and Oskel, the Rabbi Yosef and Hanine, should sit there and raise the phone up, they have no cash in the raft, 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 they have no cash in the raft. It's for the men, it's for the children, as soon as they have no cash in the raft, they have no cash in the raft. I'm finishing the shas for the first time. This is the second time that I'll be finishing shas. Be'ezus Hashem, endekum yetz de'ezus de muldafa yoyim. I'll be finishing Shas and Medjashem for the first time. I'm concluding Shas for the fifth time. I have finished the entire Shas. I will be finishing Shas. Hoy es la primera vez que completamos el Shas. I've gone through three times. I finished Shas Tafiyomi twice already. I finished the cycle three times. I will be finishing Shas for the first time. I'm finishing Tafiyomi for the sixth time. It's changed my life. Try it out. Start. If you haven't joined yet, join now. We now officially begin the 13th cycle of Daf Yomi. The Haschola, the Haschola is dedicated by Mr. Marcos Katz of Mexico City, Mordechai David Hakoyen Katz, a Sheres HaPleitoyid who helps build Torah all across the globe. May this dedication be a schus for him and his family and that he merit joining us Gesundheit Haidt at the Siyam of the 13th Machzor, Birushalayim Ira Kodesh, on Zion Teves Tov Shin Pei, January 4th, 2020. Just it is as a simcha to be Messiah Shas, it is just a big, as big simcha to begin Shas anew. I had a machshava today. This Friday morning, we begin the 13th cycle of Daf Hayoimi. We all know that 13 is the age when a cotton becomes a gadol. He is now a bar mitzvah. So this new cycle will begin the Bar Mitzvah Machzer. This comes with the obligation of being a Mitzvah Vaisa or a mandatory Mitzvah. Perhaps that is the way we can all view it as we start anew. We will now have the precious opportunity to hear from Rabbi Yaakov Hillel, Rosh HaYeshiva, of Yeshivat Chevrat Avat Shalom in Yerushalayim to be the Poiseach and the Mashil of the 13th Machser of Daf Yoimi. The first Ahmed can be found in your Hasiyam book on page 196. ברשות מרנן ורבנן, תגדולי תורה, all the great רבנים here gathered together, והיא בישורון מלך בית אסף ראשי עם, יחד שבטי ישראל, what a kiddush Hashem, what a unbelievable evening. How many is inspiring words of to Torah we've heard? Suggestions for plans for the future. 
how everyone can be zokheh to have a chilek in the dafa yomi, a chilek in Torah, a chilek in life kehem hayenu veorech yamenu. Ashrechem Yisrael, mi ke amicha Yisrael goyehad ba'aretz. In this stadium, we see clearly the words of Hazal, Hem Ratzim ve'anu Ratzim. Maybe in this stadium they, ra- they run after a, a, a football and then kick it. And Klal Yisrael came here for Kvod Hashem, Kvod Torah. What an unbelievable Kabbalat all Torah. An obligation every day, whatever the conditions are, to learn the daf together with Klal Israel. What a tremendous Limut Zichut. Look at Klal Israel. Look why they come together. Look what brings them together. Kvoda Torah, the love of Torah. A Ma'amad, we could say for sure, similar to Ma'amad Har Sinai. In the Haggadah, we have a poem. It's called Dayenu. One of the verses is a bit difficult to understand. It says, Ilu hivi otanu lifne Har Sinai velo natan lanu eta Torah Dayenu. Doesn't make much sense. All the other lines, the verses make sense. The ratio, the safer. If we say, Ilu eviranu etayam, velo natan lanu mamunam. Okay? Hashem saved our lives. He didn't give us the money, but he also gave us the money. But what's the toilet if we say, Ilu hevi otanu lifne har sinai, velo natan lanu eta Torah dayenu. What's the dayenu here? What did we get by coming lifne har sinai? Rabotai, the answer is, we got Ahdut. We stood there, Keishi Ad Belevehad. We Yihan Sham Israel Negedahar. Keishi Ad Belevehad. That alone is the biggest achievement. Even if we're not Zochel Torah, I'm not giving anyone a heter to be here and be inspired by Ahdut, by togetherness by oneness and not taking on the plan of learning. We need it. We were zochet to Torah, we got it, we received it. That obligates us to learn it. The Nefesh HaChaim quotes the Kadmoinim. We see it in the Maharal, the Arizal, the Gro also mentions it. Yisrael Notricon, the letters of Israel are Yesh Shishim Rebo Otiot La Torah. If Am Israel were not completely united at Ma'amad Har Sinai, if, if there was one Jew who was not loved, if one Jew was not part of Klal Israel, included in the love and respect for one another, we could not have received the Torah in its perfection. One letter would have been missing. If there's two Jews who are not loved, two letters would be missing. It had to be Ke'ishihad Belevehad to be able to receive the Torah in its completeness. And the truth is, nothing is more important at this time than togetherness of Klal Yisrael, the Ahdut of Klal Yisrael. As they said, we heard it tonight a few times. The destruction of the second temple was because of sinat hinam, because of baseless hatred. What we need today is ahdut. We need togetherness. We need love for every single Jew. This is what can merit us the geula speedily in our days. We pray three times a day. Teka b'shofar gadol leherutenu. Teka b'shofar gadol leherutenu. We want to hear the shofar of Eliyahu Anavi announcing the coming of Mashiach.
ושא נס לקבץ גליותינו. What is this נס? And where does this take place? ושא נס לקבץ את גליותינו. It implies that this takes place wherever you are in the world. In America, in South America, in, in Europe, wherever you are. ושא נס, lift up the banner. The banner which represents Klal Israel and unite yourself around that banner. San is lekabetz galiotenu. We have to be united where we are in the galut. And then we say, lekabetzenu mehera yahad me arba kanfota aretz leartenu. That's the that's the next stage. Once we were united where we are in the countries where we live around the. The Nes, and now the, 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 the banner, which represents Torah, then Hashem brings us as one nation, all together from all over the world, to Eretz Israel for Ogeul Shlema. What is this banner? What are we speaking about when we say, V'sa Nes lekabetz galiotenu? How can Klal Yisrael be united, wherever they are? The answer is, it's Degel Torah. The answer we're speaking about the Daf Yomi, that every single Jew is on the same page every day. Whoever you meet, wherever you meet, you can talk about the Daf. You have something in common. All of us are united with the Daf. That's the San Nes Lekabetz Galiotenu, wherever we are. If we are united with the Torah, Kuchabrichu Had, Atai Had, Vishimchai Had, as the Zohar says, Kuchabrichu or right of Israel had. Together we become one with the Baruch Hu through the connection to Torah. If we have this Achdut, we can be Zoche speedily in our days to hear the Shofar of Mashiach, and Hashem will bring us united, all of us together, together, literally. To Eretz Israel. There's a mitzvah, mitzvah I say in the Torah, not to forget Ma'amad Har Sinai. Our being here tonight helps us imagine, helps us understand, helps us appreciate what was the significance of Ma'amad Har Sinai. What is the significance of Klal Israel altogether? The Nefesh HaChaim says a tremendous sword, and I'm ending with this. Ma'amad Har Sinai, the giving of Torah to Klal Israel, revolutionized the whole world, turned the whole world upside down. It was the Olam Shel Tohu, Alpaim Tohu. And with, Ma, with Netinata Torah, when we received the Torah, a new epoch started. Alpaim Shel Torah. Spirituality, Ruhaniyut, that's what Torah means. The Nefesh Hayim explains the words of Hazal. Hazal say, On the pasuk, we'll item it a kolot. Hazal say, Haya ha nishma nir'e ve nir'e nishma. What was usually heard could be seen. And what usually is seen was heard. And the Nefesh Haim explains it like this. It's a tremendous yisod to understand the concept of this spiritual revolution that took place at Muhammad Har Sinai. If I want to explain to you spiritual concepts, what is the neshama within us? We have to write a book about that. Rabbi Menashe Israel wrote, wrote the Sefer, Nishmat Israel, to explain what is the Jewish neshama. If, I want, if we want to know concepts about the Bore Olam, we have to learn the More Nebuchim, we have to know the Zohar Kadosh, we have to know the writings of the Ari, of the great Mikubalim, you need tremendous explanations, deep explanations to understand anything spiritual. Because we're so far away from anything spiritual. 
even the nishama shall be kirbi, the soul which is in me, in me, I know nothing about. To understand my soul, I need to learn books and books to know what it's all about. On the other hand, what we see, if we see a tree, if we see a house, if we see a car, if we see Ruben, Shimon, what we see, we don't need any explanations. A chair is a chair and a table is a table. You don't need any explanation. You don't need to write books about that. The Nefesh Haim said, when Hashem gave Torah to Israel, there was a revolution, everything changed upside down. Klal Israel went into another plane altogether. They were disconnected from the physical world. They entered a new spiritual world, a high spiritual level. If someone would say to his, his khaver at Mahmad Har Sinai, look at that tree, what's a tree? He would need to read books about a tree to know what a tree was, a house. We moved away from all physicality, from anything material, from anything physical. Now, Hanir'eh Nishma, to, to, to be able to understand something which till now was visible, was known to us. We need explanations. We've moved so far away. What's a tree? What's a car? What's a table? What's a chair? We don't know. On the other hand, Hanishma Nir'eh, what was till now only understood by long lengthy explanation, by deep books discussing these spiritual topics, we saw it all. Hashem opened up the heavens and the higher heavens and we saw Hashem, we heard Hashem, we felt the spirituality, we, we saw the angels. We didn't need any explanations about spirituality, that's where we were. People who take upon themselves to have a connection with learning Torah, who make Torah the main aim in their life. I say, Torah must be fixed. Da'atana lach, literally, keep your mind on your learning day and night, that's why you're here. And believe it or not, da'atachalan, the Torah thinks about us. The Torah enlightens our eyes. The Torah teaches us. It's active. It's a Torah Hayim. As it says, that the Torah itself teaches a person how to learn, how to understand. She reveals herself to this person when you learn. We have tremendous Siata Dishmaya. Moraiva Rabotai, it's not easy to start. Kol hathalot kashot, all beginnings are difficult. The Mepharshim say, la peta hatat rovets. The Yetzirah wants somehow to pull you down at the beginning. Be strong at the beginning. The Kliyakar explains, hu yashuv harosh. The Sultan will be mikatreg. The Yetzirah will try to pull you down at the beginning to stop your learning. If you strengthen yourself, if you're strong in your Kabbalat all Torah, atat yashufenu akev. We'll meet at the next Siyum Shas with Shas behind us and the next Shas facing us to know that we've never completed the job. Whatever level we're learning, this is the Ahdut of Klal Israel. We have Dole Israel here who are now Messiah Shas. We have Magide Shi'ur, Talmide HaChamim, Bnei Torah, and we have Bale Batim, working people who are Messiah Shas. We have Bale Tshuva who are Messiah Shas. The Hazonish once said, close to the time of his departing from the world, he said, after the destruction of Europe, after the Shoah, the Holocaust, we have been able to duplicate the Olam Torah which existed in Europe. Baruch Hashem, we have an Olam Torah. But the Olam of Baalei Batim who learned Torah, the Olam, the Olam, the world of people, of simple Jews who knew Shas, this we did not duplicate yet. I think the Hazun Ish would agree that we can say tonight, Baruch Hashem, we're coming very close to that level of all of Klal Israel having a shaykhut in Shas. Really, we should be starting on Friday, so there's no big deal now to explain the Mishnah. I'm just going to read it. 
משעה שהכהנים נכנסים לאכול בתרומתן עד סוף האשמורה הראשונה, דברי רבי אליעזר. והחכמים אומרים עד חצות. רבן גמליאל אומר עד שעלה עמוד השחר. מעשה ובאו בניו מבית המשתה, אמרו לו, לא קרינו את שמה. אמר להם, אם לא עלה עמוד השחר, חייבים אתם לקרות. ולא זו בלבד אמרו, אלא כל מה שאמרו החכמים עד חצות, מצוותן עד שעלה עמוד השחר. הקטר חלבים ואיברים, מצוותם עד שעלה עמוד השחר. וכל הנאכלים ליום אחד, מצוותן עד שעלה עמוד השחר. אם כן, למה אמרו חכמים עד הסוד? כדי להרהיג אדם מן העבירה. בשם השם נעשה ונצליח, נזכה להתחיל ולסיים. אז it says in the סיום, כשם שזכינו לסיים מסכת זו, כן נזכה להתחיל ולסיים מסכתות אחרות. Next time, not only be at the סיום, next time learn from beginning to end. We once again remind those who arrived via NJ Transit to begin boarding the trains back to Secaucus in order to avoid the risk of missing your connecting trains. Thank you. Rabbi Sai, since the seventh National Sea of Hashas of Dafyoimi, 37 years ago, The Siyam has been dedicated to Zichron Kedoshim in memory of the six million Kedoshim who were killed al Kiddush Hashem. We now have the Zichus to hear from Rav Yisrael Meir Lau, Chief Rabbi of Tel Aviv. <laughs> and himself, a Sheiris HaPleitayid, a survivor of Churban Europa. who will address us for this important aspect of the Siyam. מרנן, רבנן ורבותיי, גדולי התורה, ראשי הישיבות, המוני בית ישראל, I admire your patience. I salute to you. Really, I salute. You are sitting here four and a half hours. Four and a half hours. I never met such a crowd, if I remember, to listen four hours and more to speeches, the most beautiful speeches, as Rav Shainer said, but still, to sit on a place. It's not a dinner, it's not a meal, just to see, to listen to the great Torah. I really salute you. I never had <laughs> such a pity. One thing is not mentioned yet by all the speeches. We are in the week of Shabbat Nachamu. The seder of this week is Vayet Hanan. Nachmu, Nachmu, Ami. Nachmu, Nachamu, Ami. We are behind Ben HaMetzorim. We are after Tisha B'Av. We are facing Shabbat Nachamu. And if I may have the opportunity to show you that in this week parasha at Hanan, we find a siyumashas. Siyumashas? And the beginning of a new cycle of limudashas, we can find in one of the meforshim in this week parasha at Hanan. But before, I must share with you a very personal memory. Lublin Rovs, Rabbi Meir Shapiro, his mother and my father's mother were two sisters. 
My name, my mayor, is not only after the Chofetz Chaim, Israel Mayor, but Israel was the Chort Kever Rebbe, the Avas Israel of Vishnitz, and Reb Meir Shapira, the first cousin of my father. Both were the Rabonim of Pietrikov. Lublin Rov was Rov on Piotrikov, and my father was after him the Rov of Piotrikov, the last one. Harav Moishe Chaim Lau, Hashem Yikom Dumoy. That Rosh Hashanah was mentioned here in the historic way of Daf Yomi in the last decades. Motzei Rosh Hashanah. Taf Reish Pei Dalet, 23. The Lublin Rov was not in Piotrkov yet, was the Rov of Sunik, a small town in Galicia. My father was not in Piotrkov yet, he was the Rov of Preshov, Slovakia. Mozei Rosh Hashanah. Sunik Eruv, Reb Meir Shapira. Phones to Slovakia to pressure of Eperius to his cousin, and he said him the following: Moishe Chaim es kimt ins amazeltov. Der Daf Hayoimi is ins gelungen. The Gere Rebbe ot of gehete mitten Kabula spunim of zenemen dem Oilem geben Bruches. In our gesucht, as yet is in Aran, Tau Fresh Pei Dalet Alef Tishrei, me daf me kaim zan de takune, fin de knesie gdoile, fin de meyer Shapira, and learning dem daf ayoimi. The most expensive thing at that time was the Gemore Bruches. Who had a shas that time? Who had Gmore Broches in Shtib, in his home? Very few had it. One Yid stood under one light in the street of Gura Kalavaria at that night, surrounded with hundreds of Yidin, Gerech Sidim, who came for Rosh Hashunet Zemreb. He learned the blood Broches base, and the hundreds have heard it. He ended the blood, another one. 24 hours was a cycle of Limud, Broches, Davbeis, because very few Gomorrahs were in Poland in general, in Gura, Kalavaria, particularly. Mi Yagol Afar, Mehenecha, Rabbi Meir Shapira Zetzal. To unveil his eyes. To believe that such a dream became what a kind of a reality. Not only Gerech Sidim learned Shas or Dafayoimi, but to come to the MetLife Stadium in New Jersey, near New York, and to found almost 100,000 Eden, 89 years later. Celebrating Sium Shas. Even the most optimistic dream of Lublin Roof wouldn't reach this climax. When we danced here before, after the Sium itself, I couldn't say a word because I had tears in my eyes. I cried of excitement of joy and happiness. But unfortunately, many of those who had to be today alive, my age, a little bit older, maybe even, even a little bit younger, they are not privileged to celebrate the 12th Siyu Mashas. But today was Wednesday. We started Shir Shel Yom with the words of David HaMelech. Kel Nekomois Hashem. 
Kel Nekomois Hofia. The Kel Nekomois Hofia. He appeared here in this stadium tonight. <laughs> this is the real Nekom. This is the real revenge. They said what another Posuk of Duvida Melech answers. Amru, lechu venachidem igoi, let's liquidate them of being a nation, velo yizacher shem Yisrael od. They wanted to extinguish the candle, the light of Judaism, of Jewish heritage. Lo yizacher shem Yisrael od. No more the name Israel will be heard everywhere. Look, look. 67 years later, 67 years later, never happened in the history of mankind finishing a study of a book by 100,000 people sitting in the hours. So, Yizacher Shem Israel Od. We are not liquidated, in the Torah is eternal. We are an immortal nation because the Torah we have adopted is eternity. Where is in this week parasha Siyumashas? Hishamer lecha ushmor nafshecha meod pentishka chesadvorim says Moshe Rabbeinu 40 years after Mahamad Har Sinai. Don't forget. Please pay attention when you come home to the Kli Yokor. Perek Dalit of Dvorim this week, Pasuk Tet. How can we preserve this commandment, don't forget? To forget, as it was mentioned before, is a very humanic Habit. People forget. They want to remember. But what can they do? The Kliyoko says that there is an angel, Malach, who is responsible for forgetting. His name is Shachoach. The gematria of Shachoach is 328. There is another angel responsible for rememberness. His name is Zachor. Zain Chof Reish, 227. The difference is 101. Now you understand the Gemara and Chagige. Eino doime shoine pirko mea peomim. You cannot compare the one who is studying the same Torah hundred times to the other one who is studying it hundred and one. What's the difference? If you study it hundred times, not enough. You see it's not enough. Every time you study, you minimize the power of forgetting and you encourage the power of remembrance. But if hundred times still Malach HaShichecha is stronger because the difference is hundred and one. You must learn hundred and one if you want to be sure that you will not forget. The best evident, the Gemara in Bovebasa Yud. In heaven they say, Ashrei Mi Sheba Lechan the Talmudoi Beyodoi, the Gaivet of Yerushalayim, the Minchas Yitzchok, in the Akdome of Chelek Shishi says, Lechan Gematria 101. Lamet Chof Aleph Nun. Ashre Mi Sheba Lechan, the one who reaches this point of 101 times to repeat, Talmudoi Beyodoi. What you have learned is in his hand. You cannot take away from him. What has it to do with Siyum Mashas? 
The end of the Shas is not Kol Aloy Metaloches. Harav Yaakov Hillel told us now on the name of Tana Devei Eliyahu. Kol Ashoy Nehalochois Bechol Yom. Muftach Loshu Ben Oile Mabo. Shoyne means repeating. Veshinantom Levonecho. שיהיו דברי תורה מחודדים בפיך, again and again, to repeat. So, שויינה הלוכס אינות לא אמת, אינות אבן אויסק בהלוכס, but שויינה הלוכס, means to repeat. חזר. Now it comes to the beginning of ש"ס. זה צלח. נוידה ביהודה. In his book of ברוכס צלח, ask a very simple question. Why do we call the first Besechte Broches? Broches start only in the sixth chapter. Kates and Mevorchim. Lamed Vov. The Besechte should be Kriyat Shema. Tfile. Perek Revi, Tfila Sashacha. Perek Hamishi, Chsirim Orishonim, Hayu Omdim Shoe Echaz. Or Kriyat Shema or Tfile. Why Broches? So the Noida Biuda answers, especially Rabbi Yuda Hanossi called it Broches to remind each of us before you start to learn Broches, make a Broche, Birka Satoire. Asha Kichonu be Mitzvaisa Vetsivonu, La Soik be Divrei Soiro. אשר בו חרבונו מכלו עמים, ברוך אתו השם, נויסן התוירו. ברוכס is to remind us that we are ought to be grateful to the Reboine Shlelom who gave us the toire. That's the name ברוכס, הקורס הטוב. And it was mentioned before, I think Rav Shainer mentioned, the Gemara in the Dorim, Alma of the Ho'oretz, Al Ozvo Mestoyrosi. The Gemara in the Dorim, Pei Alet says what means Ozvo Mestoyrosi before the run. Rosh Hashive. Before the run, the Gemara says, Al Ozvo Mestoyrosi, Shelo Berchu Batoyre Tchilo. They learned Toyre. They knew Toyre. Maybe they even finished the Shas. But they didn't understand to thank the Reboine Shloilom. Reboine Shloilom, thank you for the matone you gave us, Teure. In that minute, you make the broche, you receive the Teure in a matone. Because koidem broche, hashomayim shomayim la Hashem, veuretz nusan livnei udom is only leachar broche. Koidem broche, la Hashem o oretz umeloi o. לאחר ברוכה והאורץ נוסה לבני אודום. סיין תיג וספוד, סיין תיג וסטוירה. קודם ברוכה את סטוירת השם. לאחר ברוכה את סטוירוס סוי. אוי פסי סטוירוס סוי. אין נדור עם למד חס. תגמור אסס, מתחילו יומוי שרבנו לא ימי תוירו ומשכחו. עד שניתנו לו במתונה. At the moment, Vayiten el Moishe, Kechaloiso le Daber Itoi, Shnei Luchoi Savonim. At this particular moment that Moishe Rabbeinu have received the Torah Bematone as a gift, it was his, he didn't forget. So there are two ways to remember what we learn. Or to chazen 101 times, or to make every morning the Baroche. It's the Bahag. Balaluches Gdoiles, his preface to his book is Bir Kasatoire, with no one word of addition. Moirai Verabois, I want to conclude and say one word more. Yerushalmi in Chagige says, Yerushalayim Habnuya, Ke Ir Shechubra Layachdav. It's Tigbure Bavli in Tainis, meant Chubra Layachdav, Yerushalayim Shelmata, mit Yerushalayim Shelmala. But the Yerushalmi says, Ha'ir shechubra layachdav, the city which makes kol Yisroel chaverim. All the Jews become friendly 
around one consensus, Yerushalayim. I may add the Aeneas deity, if Yerushalayim, according to the Yerushalmi, Chagige, Perek Gimel, Osa kol Yisrael chaverim, the daf hayoimi, oise kol Yisrael achim, achim. When you see the crowd here, and when you know what is going all over the world, yesterday in Yerushalayim, as the Rosh Hashiva mentioned, day before yesterday, I was in a Siyum Ashas in Ramat Gan, a Siyum Ashas in the city of Modi'in. Unbelievable. Every place, all over the world. And when you saw this dancing here, and the singing together, with tears of joy in our eyes, it showed me that if Yerushalayim chubra la yachdav, osa kol Yisrael chaverim, daf hayomi, makes us one family, brothers, not only friendship, but brotherhood. And in this spirit of brotherhood, we will all zoiche that our Father in heaven will send us Mashiach Tzidkeinu Bimheiro Beyomeinu Umayim. We ask everyone to please rise as Chazan Yitzchak Meir Helfgat is mechubed with reciting the Kale Mole Rachamim Le'ilui Nishmas Hakadoshim. Yeah. 
Please remain standing for the Kaddish Le'ilu Neshmas de Kedoshim, recited by Reb Pinchas Yubefeld, a member of the Sheiris Hapleta, who we are privileged to have here with us this evening. It will be followed by the singing of Ani Mamim by Reb Shlomi Daskal.
Iskadal, Iskadash, Shmerabo. We all moon die we roeger zei, we jam lieg mag u zei, we jaat smaak weer konei, die koreef misigei. Amen. We ga je gooien, of je mee gooien, of we ga je de gooi beestjes doen. Pagulo, was man koreef, die hem roemeen. Ye heish me rabo me vura, le yulam ulome yomayo. Ye spurach vi ish tabach, vi ish pue, vi ish choymei, vi ish nasei. Vi ish ado, vi ish alei, vi ish alo, shmei di kudisho birichu. Le eilu min kovucho so vishiroso. Tush bechoso b'nechem oso, d'amirom b'yomo, v'yimre u'mein. Amen. Yehei shumra b'umini shumayu, v'chayim toivim oleinu, v'auko yisruwei, v'yimre u'mein. Amen. Hoi sheshulayim v'roimo, hu yase shulayim. Oleinu v'alko Yisrael v'yimru me'en.
As we conclude the program, please take your seats. Es ist jetzt für uns ein großes Schluss und eine spezielle Gelegenheit vorzustellen, Kvoid Kedushas, Admar, Misans, Kleisenberg, Schlitter, zu retten, Divrius Iris, wegen der Geschiebes und zu bekannten Kabel sein, Eul Malchus Schamayim. Moirai, Veraboisai, Merunen, Verabunen, Jedoile, Israel, Rusha, Alpha, Israel, Nuchaza, Heilige, Jeroise, Isoreres, Finaza, Mamet, Ferivus, Alpha, Israel, darf man bei eurer sein? Wurden die Verisoreres? Wer du in der Welt nicht in Säurer? Wo ist noch du Adresse, Ressort, das muss man gerade nach Nacht. 
Sie schreit sich heraus, wie jeden am Rudel macht ein Teurer. Er sagt, nein, nein, Lira ist mal keine. Es ist immer so schön, es ist gerade wie es gerade ist, mein Rabbi. Und das ist ein Wort, ein Mordisch Wort, und hat uns gesagt, nein, ihr sucht. Inser Nissach, zum Suchbar Kaddisch, es ist gerade wie es gerade ist, mein Rabbi. In Nacht und Batman, wie jämlich, wie deinem Namen sein, kriegt ihr mich mal Chissa, wie Jatzmach, wie Kuna, ich weiß, wie Menschen ist, wie Jatzmach, wie Kuna, wie Kuna, wie Schicha. Noch dann sucht man die Heischmai Rabu, wo es einfach dröhle, die Heischmai Rabu, mit Wurach, Lulam. Man sucht nicht Heischmai Rabu, mit Wurach, Lulam, Olman, Mayo, Teus, es im Bruch, es brennt, aber wo es, also wo sucht man die Heischmai Rabu, mit Wurach, ein Schemäuschule, ein Kissenschule, ein Matschimchesaro, ein Schelamuleit. Beit man die Heischmai Rabu, mit Wurach, das ist auch Schemäusch, Schmidtschmäusch, das ist auch Schule, mit Kissenschule. Aber wo ist Beit man nicht? Fabu sucht man nicht, Mischiach sucht immer die Tür auf Mischiach. Und da tut er Mäure drin. Sie tut zwei in Juden, mit ihnen sind nicht Gules. Eins, sie tut auch Gules, was sie in den Laden haben, aber zu uns. Man hat jetzt früher geredet, man macht da keine Mühle, ob die Schweizer Milie und die Deutsche, man muss noch gewinnen, in unser Dorf, wo es in unserem Spruch ist, in unseren Eltern, in unseren Seiten, wie viele Juden, die Eltern noch nicht sagt, wenn ich nicht beliebt, wo es noch kein Mühle nicht gewinnen sagt. Da hat die Welt steigt, die nicht mehr in der Sache sein, auf Klaus Ruhe. In der Sache sind alle Juden aus jedem Laden. In der Jäume sehen sie, wenn die Sache mit ihnen spielt. Herrn Stein, doch Sonne ist Ruhe, sie schämen sich nicht zu suchen. In der Alle müssen sie eulen, sie wollen die Churile, die Arbeit, die Arbeit, die Suchen, die Leute suchen, die Churile, die Nazi, die Leib, die Achdorf, die Leiche, die Brüste, die Kreuze, die Holle, die Hedem, die Schmerz, die Eile. Alle wollen sie die Kasse schulen. Die Kinder, die Kinder, die Kinder, die Kinder, die Kinder, die Kinder, die Kasse schulen. Weil alles durch ein Scheib ist, Ruhe, Leute. Sie haben noch nicht gesagt, wenn ich das blöd. Jüdische Kinder suchen, aber er war der Beit und der Eifstück, der immer achmen. Aber der erste Beit, der Jüd, Beit, wenn er wusste, nicht nur auf dem, was mit Rules in den, auf der Gif ist in Rules. Nicht auf der Zure, was jüdische Gifen haben. Der erste Beit, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er lacht, die Rules. Heilig, wenn es will, man glauben, jeden, dass er und da hat er gesagt, dass er immer so gerade spät mit dem Eibischen. Es ist gerade wie es gerade ist, mein Rabbi, ich muss schulen mit dieser Schule. Man betet mit sie, wie jetzt macht mich tun, wie ich 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 tun, wenn ich die Schule der alle Sonne ist Ruhe, die Hummer mal pullen, in ihnen aufgehoben werden, alle auf Tuches, alle Jeden, wo sie in ihnen umlaufen, wenn die Mischiere kommen. Aber wir hielten einfach uns unter sie, nicht auf dem Wart man jetzt auf die Mischiere, nicht nur sie in der Rechte, es lauft mit der Größer zu uns. Immer stark, an das Wart man auf die Mischiere auch. Aber die Eltern einfach mir die Heischmai Rabu mit Wurach Lula mit Olma El Mayu. In der Zipiele Yeshia ist, die Eltern ist, also mit Laben Mieden, so sagen Schmoi-Schule mit Kisse-Schule. Nur so ein Ass, ein Schmerz sein. Ich weiß nicht, wie es da drüben mal gefühlt. Man wird einladen, man wird reden, man macht das Wort durchs Platz. Ich kann einen Horror so viel. Can I know in my life, my son, what kind of be? Kind of be, I say, you always like to come. Eleven for me, we were just going to ask you, never look at him. He didn't come to us as a man, as a, as a, as a highly good sad. Do, and they're such a doisha in a rope. We didn't send him. Look at the land rulers. Look at the two thousand year rulers. You know who's? Learn the Torah from the Pe. Und das ist das Schwerste, mehr durch den Arsch ist neu gesucht. Das ist nur eines, das liebt, dass ich mich nicht mehr holen will, weil ich mich nicht mehr holen will, weil ich mich nicht mehr holen will. Zwischen du und du, tausende Reden, die sind in der Russen und in der Nussen. In der Balabatte, die sind in der Kwaii, die sind teure. Das weißt du, ob der Rest der Habe, was die Kinder haben, zu mich nicht mehr holen will. Der Rest der Habe. Sie werden auch die Größe reden. Ob Mäure gerade, ob gerade mit dem Aal absuchen, ob Beten macht das auf dem Kippischen Maim. So eine Schreden. So die Reden, Tante. 
Mir schimmen her, wo sind sie da? Da im Strand, wir wissen, wo sind die Mischane? Ich bin mir macht nicht, dass man nicht mehr das scheine Wetter. Man kann sitzen die ganze Nacht in der ganzen Rolle, befindet sich nur so. Und man geht nicht weg. Der Heilige Mädel ist durch. Der Heilige Mädel ist hier, hier im Sucht. Mai im Rabbi, im Loichli, Lechabo, ist es so Havu. So der Mädel, Mai im Rabbi, Loichli, Lechabo, ist es Havu, ist es Havu, der Havu, und der Heilige Strotz, jüdische Kinder. In der Mädel ist er Und da wollte ich schon mal die jüdischen Kinder, das haben wir haben, Rabbe. Und wer mein Rabbe, lo ich die viel, wer lo ich die viel, eigentlich so eulam. Der Gäu, wir kennen dich, aber wir da haben. So der Mädel schwerter zieh. Mein Rabbe, eigentlich so eulam, ich sage euch, mein Rabbe. Ich sage euch, was du dich wach hier ruhst, ich nehme ruhig auf die Essen, wo wir das haben. In Ur ist lo ich die viel, eigentlich so eulam. So der Mädels haben euch nicht gesagt, im Pause können wir so eulen, wir müssen eulen mal aufmachen, Kohl hat Savries, so der Mädels, die Feier Kohl macht mit allen Äußeres. Alle sind Äußeres, keine Besuche von allen müssen wir so eulen. In so einem Spellen geben von dem Eulen und von Eibischen. Und da ist es zumindest schwer, für eine Sache von ihnen. Ein neues Kapro bei den Eulen, so eine Schumka Schimka pure von dem. Wo sind die Mäher im Rahmen, wo ich das nicht habe? Wie sieht man die Gewalt, die da haben? Aber du weißt, man hat die Eibestrotte zu sehen, wo hat das Kummer, Hashem? So, der größte Hafe ist, ob man jeden Turm am Daven hat. Ahavu, Ahavas, Eulam, Maftuni. In der Teusses brennt die Bruches, dort nach Vital, wo du weißt. Der größte, der größte Hafe, Ahavas, Eulam, Ahavu, Rabu. Brennt Teusses, aber schüttet in der Scheune, wenn Teusses brennt. Als Beschachri sucht man Ahavu, Eulam. Ich habe einen Rabu und ich habe einen Rabu und ich habe einen Säule. Wo sind die von dem? Da der größte Rabu ist, sie steht in der Mädels, ich kann mit dem Rauschen, du, in der Mädels, ich habe auch schon Jesus, du noch mit dem Rauschen, sie schauen mich. Aber der Eifst hat eben den teurischen Papé in der teurischen Bersaf. Was hat der Eifst hat eben den teurischen Bersaf in der teurischen Papé? Was hat der teurischen Papé in der Schreiben geschrieben? Weil der Eifst hat gesagt, dass der Eifst hat gesagt, dass der Eifst hat gesagt, dass sie so viel Lob nicht läuft. Sie hat immer gesagt, dass sie dann sagen, die Gule ist, und die müssen alle, wenn du mal schlittert. Nicht nur mit sie nehmen für die denn alles. Dann wird auf sie nehmen, die Teure auch nicht. Sie müssen alle auf sie nehmen. Die Heilige Gesalle haben alles gesehen. Sie haben so eine Teure, die Haften, die müssen alle, sie müssen alle auf die Teure. Die Haften, so eine Bibel ist eiers. Sie müssen alle auf sie nehmen, die Teure. Sie müssen alle auf sie nehmen, die Teure. Sie schäkern, wie sie sagen, sie sind die Teure. Aber der Eibster sagt, ich will nicht. Ich will nicht, dass wir so heilen, wir sollen nur mal schlitten auf welcher Teure. Ich kann geben, Teure, ich will mal fehlen. Meine Dürre Mädels, ich kann dem Marchen sagen, Marchen sagen, ich finde es schmarrig sagen. Du sagst, wenn der Gewaltige Hafe und der Eibster zieht, wenn der Eibster der Hafe, wenn ich dann keine Gule ist, wenn ich dann keine Gule ist, von wo ist der Niedrige an der Gule ist? Na, ga toe wij niet in de marsaini. Of demo, dem ze daar iets te hebben van iedereen. Demo, ze willen niet. Ieder, ieder, dus het mooie te lumen. Ieder, een boy hebben aan me je schroeien. Of hij biedt. Kelo ieder zo zeer maar mooi. Na, gloos hij lo ja zo heeft. Of de boy is met zijn de toer is er maar per. In de ganse toer is er per waar staat de rule staat. Dus de ene van de wat toer is er maar per game van belaylo. Bij nacht. Also ich sage, dann werde ich das Siesel. Für wie ich meine, ich wüsste, wenn den Himmel, wenn es nicht tut, der Fährt ist, wenn es tut, wenn es in der Nacht. Wenn der Eifstag lebt, der Teufel ist abend, wenn es tut, und der Eifstag lebt, der Teufel ist abend, wenn der Teufel ist abend, wenn es in der Nacht. Ich sage, dann sage ich es nur, mit dem Mensch, ich habe auch schon ein paar Schuss, wo ich auch habe. Ach, sie weiß nicht, du es. Ich habe nur um Akir für den Teufel ist abend. Der ganze Teufel ist abend, wenn es auf dem Eifstag lebt, bei Nacht. Wir sind dann, dass die Räume leeren. Schäumer, Mami, Leil, du lässt was auf Nacht, sie tinkeln von ihnen. In dem Satz hat der Beutel um die jüdische Kinder. Ja, die da wissen, da habe ich dort den Sleep in Gules, in der Mitte der Gules. Ich sage, ich habe es, Eule, ich habe es, 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 du sagst, wenn ich dort gehe, der Teure, du sagst, wenn du das Wasser auf der Teuerung bist, ich sage, ich habe es, 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 ich habe Sie sind ganz zivil, um zu wissen, dass sie die Eifstadt eben die Teure verhielten. 
Teurisch war mehr, ist mehr, was du über Nacht. Es ist doch immer noch euch, aha, was eulam. Da ist doch jetzt lieber auf Eibig. Es ist vergessen von ihnen, das hast du schon lang. Deine Beutelung ist Hand, du bist ins Hand über Nacht. Sag her, also. Und wie jeden sei lernen, teure. Wie ein Idler, vielleicht hat die euch schon scheuen, nach Kurdisch Morgen, die euch schon scheuen, eh mal. Nein, Rabbi, will ich lille Chabo, ich sitze da Havu. Sie steigt, Havu sucht man, 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 Hat dem Zug mir Koi, der macht euch ein paar Israel bei Havu. Also, jeder ist nur eurer, und er wird es eurer, wie der Eibstrot ins Lieb. Immer der Fimmel, der Heilige, hat also schon mal ein Punem, ein Punem. Wird es eurer, wird es eurer zu nicht der Havu. Zwischen jüdischen Kindern zum Beurer Kolle Lumen. Nein, Rabbi, mit euch lech Havu ist das Havu. Jeden sind die Kimmel zu gehen, du zu fuhren, so ein Schmiss ist anders erscheinen. Das Ganze Zimmer. In zum Schloss In the Alle gestanden bei Bar Sina und Geherde Tor. Eure. Ich du sind der kritische Schirm, was du hart nach. Sie Der teure Schmerzwaffe ist ein Lusche Schmier, wenn ich schmerzig sein. Aber also ich steige Schmerz was der teure Schmerzwaffe ist klar also. Das ist das teure Schmerzwaffe. Schämmele keine steigt in Säuer, also es war's teu, schäm was der teure Schmerzwaff. Also in der Säuer war's ist drin und er ist Kim was der Schäm. Der Kim warst auf dem teurischen Papier. Schmeiß, was schäm oder keine, was schäm ich hat, in du Ruse, was schäm hier oder Kim. Was du das allein auf teure, auf teure Schäbapier. Von dem sagt man, schmeiß Ruhe, nur jedem kann man den teurischen Papier, sondern man jachet dem Eibischen. Der Gäum am Rotzin, der hat den teuren, der wollte den Rotzhof, sondern der Koffer im Bücher. So, da wollte ich das Ure. Nur am teurischen Papier kann man sagen, na jid. Is shmai is ruai la shem eloi kaini, a shem eloi kaini. In soma toye shem eloi kaini, toye shem eloi kaini. Shma, shmiye, toye shem eloi kaini. Doch dey ma shem eloi kaini, kreme meyachet zan de boire kralumem. Vet ne soire de hawe, vet ne boire kralumem de toye shem eloi kaini, vet ne boire kralumem de toye shem eloi kaini. Vet ne soire de gewaltige hawe, sien zum zum eibischen. Is maa yem rabim eloi ichle, chabes abo daimstern, wien so geregend.
Aber es wird nicht ausgewählt, der Habe, was ich noch zu mir, aber ich auch gewissen, der gewaltige Habe, was ich abzählt. Der Beutel wird uns gewissen, er wusste, ich kaufe es mich für mich auch. Ich will euch lernen. Seid uns mal lieb bei mir. Der Einstieg soll helfen. Es wird ausgewählt, der gewaltige, Kabules all malche Schemaim, nicht nur auf jetzt, so weiter. Aber alle solche sagen, unheim jetzt schass. Wir lernen jeden Tag weiter. Schön unheim machen nach Schule. In der Einstieg helfen, dass der Schimmel, die wir sehen, etwas sagen, ihre Schuleien, im Abenio. Es ist ein Sand, das Gadel, das Gadel, das Schmei, Rabu. Es ist ein Sand, das Schmei, das Rum, das Kern, das Ruel. Es ist ein Sand, das Jasper, das Kuhn, das Mikur, das Mischicha, das Einstieg, das Tofa, das Kern, das Teure, das Kern, das Ruel. Es ist ein solcher Sand, das wir als Ruel zeigen, wenn wir über meine Umein. We will now have one united minion from Meiriv, led by Harav Eliezer Ginsburg, the Rav of Agudish Yisrael, Snif Zichron Shmuel, and Rosh Kolel of the Mir Yeshiva. We again ask for the Mechitza curtains to be closed on Concourse 3. Mizrach is in the direction of the seating areas directly behind the dais. Shira Marois Shira Marois in a book is on the ground, the unknown is on the ballet, we see them crash over the new world and we see the same words, and it's for someone who's going to sell, 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 and it's for Mi temi cin hi shuva si soa bu shuva ni shuva samo yoga yaki ni smo hi soa bu shom yashko yachtu yashko yi shan ki yato ni vodu vata da shi vini. Yomi om yitzabad no yichazdo yoshi oshi oyi yoshi yimo yiti uho ucha yoshi yoshi sadik madin. Mo uzum bei soma. Ba yazre madin oi vay faltem yi faltem yi shoyim yi shoyim yoshi yim ki chosu boi. Yizgadeo vi yizgadeo. 
שמי רבו. ביומו דברו חירוסי, ימריך ברוך הוא סי, ויצמח בקורי בקורי משיחי. בחיי חוינו, ביומי חוינו, בחיי דרכו בייס ישראלו, בגורו ובזמן קוראים, ואמרו אמן. יהי שמי רבו מבורך ויורם, ועומי יום היום. יסבורך וישתבח ויספוער וישרימם וישנשא וישאדו וישאוה וישאוה שמי ליכוד אישו ברכו ואירו מנקור ברכוסו ושירוסו תוש ברכוסו ונחם עושו נמירון ביומו ואמרו אמן. אדוני אישיו, המלך יעננו ויום קוראינו, ברכו עש אדוני. המבוי רוח! ברוך אדוני המבוי רוח! ויירום ועד! אל חי וכיום תמיד ימרוי חורנו ירום בועט ברוך אתו אדוני המעריב ערבים כי הם חיינו, ויורך יומנו, ובהם נגיע יומם ואוירו, ויבוא שיחו, אל תוסיר ממנו, ויוירו מים. ברוך אתו אדוני, אוי ה' ומו. שמע ישראל, אדוני דוי אלוהינו, אדוני דוי יואב אותו איסא דינו יראיך, וכל נפשך וכל מי ידיך, יהיו הדברים אלו אשר נכים את זרפו יאמר לבביך, 
ישנן תור מובנה, יכול לגבור תור בום, שבחוב ואיסך, חוב ורק תחוב הדרך, ומשוך בחוב ותומך, וגישר תור מיועץ על ידך, חוב היו יותר טוב ואיס בין עיניך, וכסב תור מהמזוז ואיס ביסך, חוב ישרך, יו 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 שמו ידי שמו יום ותפיסי, שלא נכים מצב אסכם היום, ויעבו אסא דינו ירויכם ועובדוי בכל ולבבכם ובכל נפשכם, נוסעתי מתא ארצכם ואיתו ירם על כויש, יוספתו דיגונכו וסירו אשכו ויצורכו, נוסעתי אסא בסודכו ובמתכו ויאכלתו וסובותו, ישמרו ברוכם ונפטר לבבכם, וסרתם ועבדתם אלוהים אחרים משתפיסם להם, וכורו אף אדינוי ברוכם, מיוצר כסא שמיים ואיים מתור, ואדמו ריציתי נשבורו, ועבדתם מירו מירו ויצרתי בו, אשר אדינוי נכסים ברוכם, ושמתם את דבורי אלה על רבבכם, ויעל נפשכם, וקישרתם ושומעו ישראל אתכם, ויהיו תוי תופו יזבין עיניכם, ומעלתם ושומעו זמניכם לדבר בום, ושתכו ואיסכו, ורך תכו ודרך, ובשוך בכו ובתומכו, ובסבתו מהמזוזו יש ביסכו וישורכו, ומען יבו ימיכם, ימי בניכם, אל רוע דומו אשר נשבע אדינו יוהב ויסכם עושה ישראל, ימי השמיים על הורץ, ויהיו ימי אדינו יום אשר לימור, דבר רבני ישראל, יום עטו עליהם, יוסו להם ציציס, על כנפי בגדיהם ולא יוסום, ונוסנו על ציציס הכנוף, פסיר תחי לס, ויורוכם וציציס, ויישא מויסוי, וזכרתם את כל מצפו יישא דינוי, ואז יישא מויסום. ולא יששו רו, אחרי לבבכם, ואחרי עיניכם, אשר אתם זונים אחריהם, ומען תזכרו, ואז יישא מזכור מצפו יישאוי, וישאם קדושים אוהיכם, ואני אדינו יאוהיכם, אשר יצא יישא יסכם מארץ מצחיים יאוהיכם. אדוני, אלוהיכם, אמס. אמונו וכל זוהי זכאים עלינו, תהיו אדוני אלוהינו, אין זו וסוי. אנחנו נלסענו, הפיידינו מהנוחים מלכינו, הגרינו מקו חריצים. אלו הנפרון ויצורינו, ממשלנו, חייבי נפשנו. ויסא כדאי רוי שאני אתחיל, כי ניסים נפרוי שאני מספור. אסון נפשנו בחיים ונשא לנו מתרגלנו, עמד ריחנו ומסביבנו, ויורד מקננו על כל שונאנו, ויסרונו ניסים ונקומו בפרוי, ויסוי סמי פסים ואנס בני חום, אמר כי מרבו עשוי כמו בחיי מצרים, ויצא סמי יסוי מתי כל מחיר עשוי רום. אמר וימונו בגזע ים סוף, עש מתפיים ועש עיניהם ועש מי סיבה, ואמרו בנו גרוסוי שיפרו רגוש. ומלכוסוי ורצוין קיבלו עליהם מוישה ובני ישראל לכון ושירו ושמחו רבו ויאמרו חורם מחומייך אלוהים אדינוי יקמויך נדר הקודש ונוסי אוס ונוספי מלכוסיכו, רו ובונכו, בויקי היום לפני מוישה, זה לי עונו ויאמרו, אדוני יברוך ליאוי רוב ועד. כי פודו אדוני אש יעקב וגיורוי מיד חוזק ממנו ברוך אתו אדוני כל ישראל I'm 
יזגדל ויזקדש מי רבו ביומו דברו חירוסי ויבריך מלכוסי ויצמח פורקוני וקורי משיחי בחיי חוין ובימי חוין ובחיי דחובי שישראל בגורו בזמן קורי ויברו אמן יהי שמי רבו מבורך יורם ועומי עומיו יזבורך וישתבח ויספוח ויסחוימה ויסלעשה ויסדור ויסעו ויסעו שמי נקודשו ברכו ואירו מנקו ברכוסו ושירוסו תוש ברכוסו ונחם בוסו דמירון ביומו ואמרו אמן תזכבל צרוי סוי נובו סוי דחורבי ישראל קודם עבורוי דמשמע יום יברו אמן יש רומו רבו מנשמע יום יחייב תויבי בורנו ועל כל ישראל ואמרו אמן הוא יעשה שורוי ממרוי מוב, הוא יעשה שורוי מורנו, ויעל כל ישראל ויברו רבים. ראינו ראשון בלילי יחד עם נתון הסיסון בעצם השס. שרוי יסור נוקי יצור ושרוי יסור נוקי יצור ושרוי יסור נוקי יצור ושרוי יסור נוקי יצור ושרוי יסור נוקי יצור נאמר ואוי הוא אבי נוי רומל איך על כל אורץ אוי מה הוא יהיה אבי נוי אחד ושמו אחד יזגדל ויזקדל שמי רבו ביומו דברו חירוסי ויבריך מלכוסי ויצמח פרקוני וקורי משיחי בחיי חוין ובימי חוין ובחיי דחורבי שישראל בגורו בזמן קורי ואמרו אמן יהי שמי רבו מבורך יורם ועומי עומיו יזבורך וישתבח ויספוח ויסחוימה ויסנשאי ויסעדו ויסעו ויסעו שמי נקודשו ברכו ואירו מנקו ברכוסו ושירוסו תוש ברכוסו ולחם עושו דמירון ביומו ואמרו אמן יהי שרומו רבו מנשמיו וחיים תויבי בורנו ועל כל ישראל ואמרו אמן אוי זה שורוי ממרוי מוב, הוא יעשה שורוי מורנו, ויעקור יש...
ישראל, אמרו אמן. We want to thank everyone for coming and participating in this truly historic evening. Please feel free to take extra copies of Haseem and Haseem Jr. on your way out tonight. On behalf of the entire executive committee and staff of Agudas Yisrael and the Siyam Ashas, we want to express our sincerest appreciation to the entire management and staff of MetLife Stadium to as well as to the various security agencies, including federal, state, and local agencies, who did an unbelievable job in ensuring the safety and comfort and enjoyment of everyone here tonight. Please exit carefully and have a pleasant and safe trip home. Thank you. Yeah.